Hello, everybody. Sorry, don't mind us. We're just like really jamming to this song. Give us a second. I'll give Sergio a second. He's the dancer. Tens, tens, tens across the board. This is so 80s. Like, I love it. I just want to be like in a dark club right now. Like, things are flashing. And I'm just like have my drink I'm just like oh my god <laughs> anyways anyways how is everyone doing welcome 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 to uh, Sunday nights wait no what's our title again scary streaming Sunday scary streaming Sunday <laughs> See, Sergio has that announcer voice. I don't. I just, I sound shrill and bitchy when I get loud. Oh, do As, you really? Oh, no, you do. You yes. Do. It has it's actually cute. started arguments where I'm just trying to be heard and Sergio thinks that well, I'm being a bitch. Cody has a, Cody has a way of... <laughs> Are we really going to get into this right now? I'm really going to get into this right now. I mean, I was totally blaming me here, but no, sure, fine, Cody, whatever. Read me more. Cody has like fill. that, uh, that, that um, thing in his voice where he kind of Sounds like he's asking a question uh, sometimes. We're like, really? Or he sounds really sarcastic, but he actually means well. <laughs> Cody got that white woman shrill. Oh, no. Hey, I'm going to walk out. Oh, no. We're starting off strong. <laughs> Listen, I don't even have alcohol. Like, I, I'm. this is my natural. What? What is it? Um, natural. Uh, Persona. You, you, there's like a word for it, like natural ecstasy. I'm just not. That's my album name, Sergio. Natural, natural ecstasy. ecstasy. Yes. Anyways, so what happens is that we t tend to like set everything up. We make sure our dog is okay and taken care of. We check the lights, but we have the 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 music playing, and this song that was just playing was just like. There's something about it that was like, wait a minute. This makes me feel like I'm in an 80s movie and I'm the last girl to be hunted and I'm just trying to survive. And this is like the end credits song. Oh, anyways, let us know if you feel the same. <laughs> <laughs> Plus we're playing the quarry today. So it makes, it doesn't take place in the 80s, but um, I don't know if you, if you have to finish the game, but there's an 80s filter. I want to say it's where, like a DLC. Maybe we do have to finish the game. I don't know. Where everybody like dresses up or like is in 80s gear. We'll just play it again when we're done. We will just become a, a quarry yeah. live stream. Well, we'll we're going to go down every <laughs> quarry. potential left Only or the right bad turn. decisions. Only the bad decisions. Uh-huh. Oh, my God. Um, well, guys, welcome to the live. Starlight, hi. First time catching a live. Love your channel. Thank you welcome. so much. Welcome to the live stream. Um, we are on number 14. So this one's actually kind of a special one. Actually, let me edit this title. Hold on. Because I am not doing this today justice. We're doing Continuing the Quarry Part 4 and celebrating our... No, no. Celebrating two-year channel anniversary. Yeah. Wait, how do you spell anniversary? Not like that. Oh. <laughs> there you go. You got it. Yeah? Yeah? Yeah. Yeah, um, yeah that is right, guys. We, our channel was two years old on August 23rd, but we're going to make it September September 3rd. All right? Um, we released a trailer onto our channel. Mm -hmm. We got on here. We decided to show our faces on the interwebs. Um and here we are now, two years later, and we're doing live streams. Mm -hmm. And thank you for that super chat, Diabadass. Diabadass. I love that name, actually. <laughs> Best part of my 16-hour work day. Oh, my God. 16 hours. Well, well we can help you get through. 16-hour yeah. shifts are rough. Hopefully, we can help in any way. I hear you. I, I always found out last minute that I had to work overtime because the person didn't show up, and then they asked me to stay longer. So... Mm -hmm. 
I hated that. Uh, but yeah, two years. If two years of the YouTube channel, I would say maybe it's three years of the horror bandwagon. Maybe a little bit more. Maybe a little bit more because we started as a podcast. Mm -hmm. uh, that was our first thing. We sat down during a pandemic. We t thought of the horror bandwagon and we started making podcast episodes, which are still live now. You can go listen to them. Uh, the first episode might be a little rusty. You know, we were still figuring ourselves out. Um, I can even say that to like the channel, like when we were still trying to figure shit out. Uh, but yeah, here we are two years later. Let's see. JP says, I dropped everything I was doing like Sergio last night to make sure I was available to watch the stream tonight. Two years. <gasps> yeah. Thank you. Thank you. We're so happy you're here. Yes. We're, JP, you're always on a stream. Thank you so much. MVP. Hayden as well. Happy two anniversary. Oh, I love that. Mm -hmm. I love two anniversary. Potato, the first video I saw was when Sergio watched Scream 5 trailer with Bourbon. Mm -hmm. If you guys didn't know, um, Cody uh, was working when uh, the Scream 5 trailer came out. And I said, fuck it. So I said, I'm going to have Bourbon next to me, our dog, which you guys now know, um, on for that video. And it's still up on our channel. So you can go over there and check me and Bourbon reacting to. Somehow he sat still on this chair for like five minutes. Not I for don't long. I know how you did Not it. for long. Crazy McT, I'm loving your Saw reactions. Just look on Cody's face. <laughs> Gives me everything. When I'm editing, I tell myself like, Cody, you need to, you need to change your face because you're literally like this the whole time. Yeah, I mean, that sums up Saw. It's like just it, the whole time. It's so funny. Uh, damn, it's been two years. I've been with you guys for two years. Crazy. Oh, well, listen, Crazy Meg, you are an OG. We appreciate you. We love you. Ben T Taylor, I just finished your software reaction. Great video. Love you guys. I've been watching since the Chucky reactions. You're all the best and happy two years. Thank you. Thank you. Listen, Chucky means a lot to us. Like, he's our boy. He's That is the first show that we reacted to. Um and we didn't know what was gonna come up with it. Like we were just like, why not? Let's try it. And we did it. We had a great time. We even dressed up because it was around Halloween. So mm -hmm. we like did some makeup and did a little bit of that. And here we are. Now we're going into like reacting to season three. Um, Hayden says, I watched the Saw 4 reaction after the live. I would have watched it, but Night of the Demons just finished. Tell us what you thought of Night of the Demons. Oh, yeah, That's Hayden. One of our favorites. I mean, you can tell us in the Discord, but you can tell us here, too. We want to hear it. Yeah, I want to know what you think. Jamesy Kaz, as I said before, I've been around since the channel's inception. Yes, Jamesy. Jamesy, you'll read us the filth, but you'll also love us at the same time. So we, we, we love you. Happy 2 anniversary. Everyone remember to like the stream. Yes, if you can, of mm -hmm. course. I always like hate asking for people to like like and subscribe just because I feel like, you know, if you want to. But we want you to. Mm -hmm. uh, I am horrifying says Screen Queen's reaction was so funny might actually make me like season two. <laughs> okay. I've seen some comments about it. It's actually pretty surprising um, how much we like it. Now, granted, we only reacted to the first two episodes of season two. It could go downhill from there. Jamal says, oh, and I finally caught up on your reactions to season one of Scream Queens. Season Great. one will forever be in our hearts. It was amazing. He says it was a fun time. Angela served, served all the cunt. Uh, yes. Mm -hmm. Angela is that bitch. And I'm telling you, I'm going to do the dance. I'm going to be an Angela drag. It's going to happen. Oh, Carrie. You want to read that one? Yeah. Carrie Green says, I just found your channel yesterday, and I've been binge watching your videos. I'm going to watch the Chucky ones tomorrow while I do some chores around the house. Yes. Well, welcome. Uh, now, remember, our Chucky season one videos are, you know, the, the inception of our channel, pretty much. So. Well, they were still really good. You uh, undersell yourself constantly. You are great. I've grown. I think I've grown editing-wise. You can still have been good, and now you're better. Oh, imagine I'm just like, I, I've always been good, honey. 
Cubby Holes, welcome. I'm on my way home from Costco. Got my Pollo Loco ready to stream with you boys. Yes. yes. Wow, that was gay. That was <laughs> Sorry about it. Jacob Young, I better see some Chanel themed scrubs for the Scream Queens finale. We can oh, maybe make that happen. We're already in talks. We're already like thinking of shit. Girl Wolf, some scary videos about ghosts today, maybe? Uh, what you uh, what do you guys think? Um, we actually have a video from Mr. Nightmare we're gonna react to called Five Disturbing True Home Alone Stories. Just terrify me. And that's just to get us in the mood. And then we're gonna go right into the quarry and we're gonna go up until we're gonna power through it. We get tired because yeah. we're old men and we can't be like streaming for eight hours, you know? Like, I mean, maybe, maybe for like our five year channel anniversary, we'll, we'll do like a 24 hour stream of just us being petrified for 24 <laughs> hours. Five years or 100K, make it happen. Wait, you're saying it take us five years to get a hundred? No, 100K? I'm saying five years or a hundred k. If we get a hundred k oh, faster, oh yes. Wait a minute. No, let's do that. Tell your friends. A hundred k. We reach a hundred k. Do it right now, guys. Clip it. Send it to everywhere. If we reach a hundred k, we're gonna be doing a twenty four hour stream. Mm -hmm. It'll happen. It'll happen. It won't be pretty. It won't be pretty. <laughs> and we'll happen. have to take turns going to to walk our dog, mm -hmm. but we'll it do beats. it. We'll do it. Um, too much to bear. Nah, you guys are the picture of you. <laughs> thank you. Well, thank, thank you. you. Uh, I, I appreciate that. <gasps> Wait a minute. Hold up. I'm going to have to reread this. Jacob Young, Cody, the side eye you just gave Sergio for saying a 24 hour stream. <laughs> Babe. <laughs> See what I mean? See what I mean? He's shady. He's shady queen. Sorry about it. That's going to be my new catchphrase. Drew Gulak, who's your favorite character so far in the quarry? Um, naked, well, barely naked. Jacob? I don't remember anybody's names. Well, Jacob. Jacob is the one who was naked. He had his briefs on, which yes. he still has. And, but that's because just, you know, you know he just, um, but second, I would say the person who is who is with Ryan is my favorite. I can't remember his name. The one Dylan? who's like Dylan, yes. Dylan, yeah, Dylan is good, fave. but I have to say Caitlin is oh, the girl. I mean, how could how could I forget? Caitlin is the girl. Also, uh one of my maid of honors is her name is Caitlin, and I feel like they have the same vibe. So like I think that's why I gravitate to her. Nani over here saying Gemini's like to be shady. You know. You know. <laughs> You know, <laughs> um, CG, have y'all seen Chucky Popcorn Holder at Universal Studios? Yes. Yes. We have already decided <laughs> when we're going to buy it, how we're going to get it home. Yeah, because we were going to buy it online and it's already sold out. So, Ooh, apparently or out of stock. Jacob in the 80s outfits is in a crop top. <gasps> oh, my God. We need that in our life. Can we switch it over to the 80s outfits like mid play we'll have to find out for next week for next week yeah i don't want to ruin our, our our thing anyways let's go over to i think it's all right we're at 20 minutes i think it's a good time to head over to uh story time i think so let's do it and reina i did see your question about how how do i feel about having a real chucky doll in the house sergio doesn't know this yet but there are chains in a padlock waiting for when that box arrives you're not touching my Chucky doll, okay? Oh, I'm uh, not touching the doll. I'm putting it around the outside. Chucky, the Chucky doll will make an appearance starting next week. It's going to get here. It was supposed to get here two days ago, but UPS was like, nah, bitch. You're going to wait. And now we're going to get it on uh, Tuesday. Hayden made a little album cover art for Sergio's natural ecstasy. Oh my god. Okay, we need to see oh this. Oh god, Hayden, I'm not, I'm not ready. Oh <gasps> yes. Yes, this Stop is amazing. It. Stop it. I love it. I love it. I'm gonna wait. I got a super, super duper. Yes. Not Pirate Bay. LimeWire, nah, man. <laughs> That's so good. If you guys want to see what we're talking about, go to our Discord. Go to our Discord. 
So good. So good. Um, but yeah. Oh, Girl Wolf. Hello, Girl Wolf. I love your horror scary movie reactions, guys. Seriously, and it's amazing and fun. I don't feel scary when I watch with both of you, but I will love it if you guys do a reaction to Last Shift. It's on the list. It's in the works. It actually might be coming out this month. So we are working on it. We will see. Oh, did you see that? Another another side eye. Count the side eyes. Drink whenever <laughs> Cody does a side eye. Responsibly, of course, you know. Drink water. All right. Stay hydrated. Let's go over to our reaction little section. We. And we have dog ham in the reaction now. It doesn't say doggy cam on it, unfortunately, because I forgot to put that there. Uh, but just know that it's a doggy cam and not just like a uh, white thing <laughs> on a blanket. Um, all right. Oh, I see Charm Diary says, hi guys, will you be doing until dawn? We might be. Um, I say that because number one, we have to figure out how to get on this computer. I know you can use PS now, we've just oh. never done that. And Ooh, hold on. number two, Sergio played through a lot of it during quarantine, and I was only half paying attention from the other room. So um, that may be something that we do for some lives later is maybe just have me play through until dawn or us play through until dawn together. We'll see. Cody just wants to do stuff without me, so it's fine. He's going solo. Lies. Um, I'm still the Beyonce. Cody is going to be the Kelly Rowland, even though... A I'm gonna get red because people are gonna say like Kelly Rowland is a shit. She is. She is. Potato, no, Sergio. I'm home alone. No, <laughs> sorry, sorry. If we, we're gonna have to experience this together because we're we're technically home alone too. <laughs> Does Jamesy that Cat says Cody, stop being so salty, you fruity nightmare. <laughs> Fruity Nightmare is also going to be your Nightmare album. Is, is my album. Your hey, album. Don't make that. <laughs> we'll do the um, uh, the Outcast album, where like one side is one person's Ooh. album, the other the other side is the other person's album. That's what we'll do. The Horror Bandwagon presents Sergio. Uh, what what, what was my Sergio's name? Natural Ecstasy. Natural and Ecstasy. Cody the Fruity Nightmare. The Fruity Nightmare. They can also be uh, colognes or perfumes or mm. our, our makeup line. <gasps> That would definitely be like our first two palettes. Or our like tequila brand. All right. Okay. We All need right. to move on. Sorry, 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 <laughs> sorry, sorry. You talk over here saying, what if your Chucky is possessed? Girl, that's what I'm worried about. Sergio's no. going to be up here doing some elf on a shelf bullshit with that doll. I'm not ready. And Halloween season is coming up. That That's the time to do it. All right. Let's 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 watch this so we can get to the quarry. Oh, shoot. I always forget that I mute the thing. You... No, because I am a dumbass. I don't know how to stream. <laughs> oh, maybe I don't know how to stream. Hold on. It's still not unmute. That's why. Eh. There we go. We good. We good, guys. I'm 30 years old, and I share a house with my sister. It's a... We're 30 years old. Well, no, not exactly 30, but we're, we're in, in that range. Two-floor house. A mother-daughter house, meaning it has two kitchens. My sister takes the downstairs. I take the upstairs. My sister isn't home a lot because she often stays with her boyfriend who lives 20 miles away. Like I said, I'm 30. That's a nice I shouldn't let being home alone ever freak me out. But, admittedly, sometimes it does. This happened on a night that I was home alone in my living room watching a scary movie. Nope. My part of the house is an open layout, so the living room, dining room, and kitchen are all one big space. Right. My couch is in the middle of the space, so as I watch TV on the couch, my back is to a large part of the room behind me. Uh, okay. So no. for those a little more easily that spooked, just You need to know your feng shui. Yeah. You need to know your feng shui a little bit. Mirrors, motion lights, floodlights outside, yeah, you cameras so everywhere, you can really private take a, security guard constantly watching everything. These are my minimum requirements for living in a house alone. Yeah, I can't I love the open space, but like at least know, you know, where the door is. You can see the door a little bit, you know. 
not good. I mean, granted, we can't see the art front door right now, but that's fine. Cody always checks that the door is locked. Always. The most comfortable place to be sitting alone watching a scary movie. I'll admit, as I watched in the dark room with nothing but the light from the TV to cancel the darkness of the room, I found myself glancing over my shoulder a lot. I like to think I'm not the only 30-year-old male that does that. Okay. But anyway, after the movie, I brushed my teeth, turned off all the lights in the house, then went to sleep. My sleep lasted for about two hours. I woke up around 1 a.m., and I wasn't sure why I woke up at first. Mm. Then I heard a voice downstairs. It sounded like my sister. Okay. Not too bad. This is Mantella catalog stuff. <laughs> it sounded like she was inside the house, so it's not like she was calling for me to open the door. But still, I knew it was my sister's voice. This is why you get a dog. I didn't know what she was yelling up to me, though. But I was still groggy and not thinking straight. Girl, All I could up. think was that she must have been calling for me or arguing with her boyfriend. So it's I got out of bed and went into the pitch black hall. I turned on the hallway lights and then made my way through the living room and heard my sister's voice again from downstairs. Now I could understand her to be saying my name. I made my way downstairs in the dark, yelling back at her, what is it? I looked for the light switch in the foyer downstairs, but couldn't find it. I'm not Flashlight. lying when I say I was groggy as hell. I walk down her little hallway towards her kitchen, find a light switch, okay, and we flip get it, it on. Groggy. The light in the kitchen lights up her little apartment, including her living room. The light starts off dim and needs time to brighten up, but I still saw that there was no one down there. Not okay. her, not her boyfriend. I went okay. to her bedroom, but it was empty. I called her name really loudly one time. No one called back, but shortly after I yelled, I heard something drop to the floor in my sister's bedroom, which I had just oh. checked and it was empty. Uh -uh. I went That's back up shivers. the stairs like a little kid and went back to my bed to where my phone was. I tried you didn't to call her a few phone? times, but she didn't pick up. I had myself locked. Mistake number one. Girl. Well, several mistakes, but like, have your phone with you. It's a I, flashlight. It's like part of my body now. Like, I will always be going around. I'll, yeah, I'll use my phone as the flashlight. And if I hear noises, it's time for me to close that door and turn on all the lights, even the TV, mm -hmm. just to be like, I'm present. Or is that bad? Oh, the TV will drown out the sound of the person who is trying to hide from you. Yeah, I think that's bad. Never mind. Don't take that advice. Don't take that advice. In my room, wondering if I had just hallucinated all of that. Yep, definitely. Eventually, I fell asleep. And in the morning, I woke up to text from my sister asking why I called her at 1 a.m. I asked her if she was yes, home last girl. night, yeah, and she you told home? me no. She was currently staying at her boyfriend's house. I went downstairs to her bedroom to see what may have fallen down on the floor, but there was not a single object on the floor that could have made that noise. Ghosts. I'm led to believe I hallucinated everything I heard that night, but that's what I want to believe, because the alternative would be much more horrific. But I've never really hallucinated anything else or had any kind of sleep disorders, so how vividly I heard my sister's voice and that sound in her room really freaks me out. You, right. talk, uh, you coming in strong. <laughs> the narrator sounds hot. He does. He does. I think that's also why I gravitate to Mr. Nightmare is because, one, he sends shivers down me timbers. Um, but two, um, his voice is very soothing. Someone mm -hmm. find the picture of what this man looks like. All right. I gotta say, I mean, so many mistakes were made here. Listen, I hear a noise in this house alone at night. Nine one one immediately. What are you doing? Like nine one one immediately. 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 Someone is in That's my a little house. much. I think. <sighs> immediately. <laughs> you know how long it I, can take, especially think, around the country. I think follow the bear precautions, which is like grab two sticks and go, like in a Parent Trap. So that way, you know, you make your presence known. Like, bitch, I'm here. What's that Beyonce song? Immediately. Um. So as you guys don't know, like, Mr. Nightmare does these stories, and they're actually, quote, unquote, based on true, true things, mm -hmm. because uh, people submit them to Mr. Nightmare. If you're not subscribed to Mr. Nightmare, please subscribe to Mr. Nightmare. Watch his videos. They're amazing. You know what else is wild to me? Like... I would not have been able to go to back to sleep without checking all the doors, checking all the windows, making sure they're still locked. I don't like, think I could go back to sleep. I, 
I would feel uneasy the whole entire time. Yeah. I, I would need to investigate what the noise was. I need to make sure. Mm. Story two by Ban Ban. That was deep. Mm -hmm. I was left home alone a lot as a kid, just due to the fact that my mom was single for a good chunk of my upbringing, and she worked as an RN on a crappy RN schedule, and my brother went Damn. away to college. This was a mom. night that my mom was working in overnight. It was a weekend night, so I had this girl Molly over who I was talking to, and she hung out for Aww. a while. Molly. We watched a couple movies and whatnot, and eventually she had to go home because her parents don't like her out late, so I was left alone to hold down the fort. I continued oh, to watch God. TV in my room and bed. My bedroom is upstairs next to the backyard, so when someone dragged one of the chairs on the deck outside, I heard it. Nope. I got up and looked out the window, and I, I saw someone effects. sitting on one of the deck chairs down below. I called Molly's name, thinking it was her. After all, she'd only left under ten minutes ago. Molly. Whoever it was looked up at me, but it wasn't it. Molly. She's not Molly. I immediately uh -uh. pulled away from the window to hide. I was not anybody I recognized. Oh God. Not in the darkness, at least. I texted a few close friends in our group chat if it was one of them messing with me. The ones who answered all said no and asked what I was talking about. I didn't really believe any of my friends would come to my house to mess with me like that anyway. Scared shitless, but still curious, I slowly walked back over to the window to look down again. Oh, no. That person was still sitting in the chair, oh, and looking no. up at my window. <gasps> no. He, that much was clear. All right, that man is standing, but... I hurried away from the window again to turn off the TV. I sat in my bed in a ball, basically, with my arms wrapped around my knees. I waited in darkness oh. for a while. I didn't even want to turn my phone screen on because I was scared he'd see the light. I didn't even want to move because the window was opened, and I feared that he'd hear any movement I made. Okay, I wanted so him to assume I was just no longer in the bedroom. Yeah. Hello, 911. That, I waited enough time. There's somebody outside. It had to be a Who's solid five running? minutes of just sitting there. I highly doubted that man outside could still be there. I finally mustered up the courage to get up and look out the window. I felt a little part of me die inside when I saw he was still down there, oh looking up God. at my window. Call Instead of running too. away from the window again. I tried to be brave and said down to him, what do you want? <gasps> what? Nope. I then noticed his shoulders I mean, starting brave. to go up and down as if he were laughing really hard, but he didn't make any kind of audible laughing sounds at first, till I heard a slight whistling sound coming from him. Nope. It seemed like he was laughing so hard that he was wheezing. I asked him to please go That's away, then walked away from the window That's again. I went back to my bed. I was scared to call the police for some reason. I left my room and sat at the top of the he's stairway a, a listening. Kid. The back door was being pushed. What are you he was doing? trying my to get into the house. On the floor. I ran back to my room to hide again. I was 14. I didn't know what else to do. Yeah, I would be Eventually, I heard the front door's door not being fiddled with, and the man trying to push the front door open as well. He gave up quickly, thank God. I closed my bedroom window and curtains. Mm -mm. If our doors weren't locked, I could have been killed easily. I was skinny and weak when I was 14, and definitely not a fighter. I didn't leave my room again that night until my mom got home around 9. I told her what happened, oh. and her reaction was angry at me for not calling 911, and in hindsight that was very stupid of me. Probably. One of the many things I did, or rather didn't do at a young age, that I yeah. questioned greatly. Yeah. Oh my god. Alright. The fact that the man is still out there. This is just an open... Public announcement. Oh, no. To any of my Public friends who may be listening, to you, to, to any of y'all, uh. if you show up at my house pretending to prank me, <laughs> hold no. on. No, I, I will no. get to that in a moment. No. I am calling the cops on your ass. It's going to happen. I don't care. I don't fuck around with that shit. No, thank you. Well, now you know that we'll be safe for mm -hmm. the most part, hopefully. All right, um, now but I see that Hayden if, has created my album cover. I actually love this. This is amazing. Cody present. I love the font. You really went like early two thousands, like twenty tens, actually twenty tens font. This is just fantastic. This is definitely like a pink album. Ugh, I wish I could like. It's okay. Go to our Discord. You want to see it? Go to the Discord. Go to the Discord. Um, the 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 link is in the description below. Mm -hmm. Um. But Hayden, you, you're 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 too good at this. Top you're, notch. you're too good at this, and quick. You're mad quick. Um, all right, are we ready to go on to story three, guys? Number three. Let's do it. The 
This was the story of how I almost died as a young kid, like home this. alone. This Possibly like the most intense night of my life. To me. That actually, well, this effect that's like, burr, burr, burr. Yeah. but also the fact that it just starts off as being like, this is the story of when I almost died. This is the story of a girl. Hey, no, I wish I knew lyrics really well. And something, something in the whole world. Who cried a river and drowned the whole world. She didn't call 911 when she could have. And now she's dead. Oh, wow. Well. <laughs> With way too much going on. We're a family of five. I was 10 at the time. My older brother was 14. My little sister was five. It was a Friday night. My brother was out with his friends causing trouble, clearly, because a dreaded phone call came to my parents. All I remember was I was in my room playing a Star Wars video game when I heard my mom start freaking out crying. I got really scared and hurried to see what was wrong. My mom was on the phone with the hospital, calling to inform my parents that my brother had gotten hit by a car. Obviously, we were all shaken and really scared. My brother's leg was broken, but I don't know what else was said on the phone. All I know is my parents hurried to get their coats on and got my little sister from her room and asked me if I was okay to stay home alone. Oh my God. I said yes, and they hurried out to the car and left. I was of course really worried for my brother, but I really didn't want to go to the hospital and see him in any kind of bad condition. Aww. I don't think my parents wanted me or my sister to either, but they didn't want to leave my five-year-old sister home without them. Maybe this is why you it's like It's worth mentioning my brother recovered just so fine. Just say, like, as his injury them? is no longer relevant to the story other than it being the reason why I was left home alone on a Friday night. Before my dad left, he was trying to calm down my mom, telling her he was going to be okay. So seeing my dad like that made me feel better. I had a feeling my mom was just being overdramatic like any mom would be. I continued playing Girl. the Star Wars game for a couple more hours. When I heard the front door open... This sounds nope. like you. I had this sounds like something like you would do. You're the Star Wars, you know, lover. So you would be playing Star Wars... You'd be staying home. Honestly, I probably would have, um, especially if like this person is is fourteen. Yeah. Um. And yeah, I probably would have been home alone playing like Knights of the Old Republic for the millionth time. <laughs> and, um, I mean, but the so the other thing that's that's kind of scary for me is my mom used to be part of this like scrapbooking. It was definitely pseudo multi level marketing, but whatever. <laughs> it, we got a lot of good scrapbooks out of it, and um, so she would like have customers like she'd just leave stuff like outside her front door for customers to just come oh, pick stuff up. No. There were times where I was home alone. I just like see someone roll up, park, oh, no. walk up, grab something from between the door. No, my so something that I'm gonna pass on to our kids one day is something that my dad did very well at is making us scared so my dad would always be like do not open the door do not open the door for anybody even if it's someone that you, like they scheduled someone to come by the house to pick something up and they're not home do not answer the door that's what they told me so like and honestly to this day i kind of do it too even with like phone phone calls like if even if it says like this is a safe number i am mm -hmm. blah blah I will not answer it if I don't know it. So <laughs> my dad scared me and it still works to this day. My bedroom door closed. By this point, it was easily past midnight and past my bedtime. So I turned off the TV and PlayStation and crawled into my bed with my Game Boy. I tried listening to hear my parents' voices, maybe hear if my brother was with them or just hear what they were saying, but I didn't hear anything. After a few minutes of not hearing them even come up the stairs, I had a feeling something was wrong. I went to my door and quietly opened it, oh and walked God. over to the ledge and banister oh. that overlooked the living room. Bad. The lights were off, but Bad. there were three tall people standing in my living room. They weren't my family. Nope. I was so petrified that I was frozen for a second before I could quietly walk back into my room and shut the door as quietly as I could in my trepidation. But it wasn't quiet enough, and I knew it. <gasps> they had to have heard the door click shut, even if just slightly. I hurried to my closet door, opened oh it God. quietly, oh stepped God. inside, then shut the door. I had myself sitting behind a bunch of the boxes and bags of clothes that were stuffed in my closet. I was actually pretty covered from view. There was a short period that felt like forever that I was anticipating my bedroom door open, oh and God. it did. <gasps> and at that moment, I knew I was going to die. 
I heard footsteps walk into the room. I couldn't tell how many people. It may have been one, it may have been two. I heard the footsteps move to my bed. Then I heard my covers being played with. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, I wanna throw up! Then silence. Yeah. Then more footsteps towards the closet door. Then silence for a few seconds. And then the closet door opened. No! Oh god. My heart was in my Everybody throat quiet. by this point. All Look I did around, was sit quietly and hold my breath. The door was open for a really long time, but I didn't look up. I didn't move. It had to be a good 20 seconds of silence before the door closed again. Footsteps walked away from the door, then out of the room. I finally looked up, and I just realized, from where I was crouched down behind the bags and boxes, I may have been visible to that person. <gasps> it wasn't until probably an hour that I heard my parents return. I ran downstairs to them. The front door was left ajar by the people who broke in, and they had stolen a number of valuables from our oh, house. Shit. It was a night that just went from bad to worse for our family. My parents were in such a rush when they left for the hospital that they apparently didn't even lock the door. I was lucky to have not been killed or kidnapped. I look back now and really wonder if the person who opened the closet and just stood there for 20 seconds saw me hiding in there. Maybe he was just a guy that came to rob a house, not to kidnap yeah, or hurt a child. That's what I'm thinking. Like, you or know what? I'm not going to like see mess me, with this kid. And I just narrowly escaped death or injury. Uh uh. This is so scary. This is so fucking scary. And what of like, you know, home invasion movies are are scary, scary genre. I was home alone for an entire week. So one this time gets me. When I was still a teenager living with my parents, which was a rare occasion since my parents don't go out a lot. My mom's rich friend Patty invited my parents on a trip that she was paying for. Ooh, rich I'm an only Patty. child, yes. so I was left alone in the house. Oh, we lived in Newark, Ohio, which is in Licking County. That's fabulous. Yes, our county was actually called Licking County. Uh, my parents' old house had woods in the backyard and was on some Licking quiet county. road that only a few cars would pass per day usually. We had a huge deck in the backyard overlooking the woods. Also, quick shout out to Chance hey, from Chance's House hey, is Hard. Hey, boy. <laughs> and a decently large backyard. We even had a little fish pond and above ground swimming pool. This was on a Thursday night. I remember because I had conversations with friends about plans for the weekend that day. This was that in July a, of 2013. I, love that little balcony. Mm -hmm. I, mean, I was out on the deck weird, smoking weed like with my it. speaker playing music. That's about the time it started. I thought I heard a voice from out in the woods. No. I lowered the music and listened for a little bit. No. It didn't repeat, so I raised it back up. Yeah. When the music was loud again, I heard a voice from out in the woods again. It's Patty. This time She's I turned the music off completely and listened for longer. There was a voice calling from the woods again, confirming I wasn't just hearing things. Uh-uh. It was a male's voice saying, hey, over here. Nope, nope. He was kind of distant, <laughs> done, but not yeah. too far. So the I'm woods gonna go were in. anywhere from twenty to thirty yards away from the deck, and that's where the voice was coming from. So he was actually meeting up with another guy in the woods, and it's like, oh shit, not you. I'm sorry, I meant somebody else. Not cruising, not bringing that in cruising, here. Cruising, cruising no, no. in there. That, maybe that. I, I, you mm. don't know. Maybe they were. Maybe they I were. I didn't think in a million years it was someone calling out for me, though. Rather, maybe just some kids playing manhunt or something. The voice called out again. Oh, I used to hey, love... over here, we need help. The fact that I actually played manhunt, like, at night. Like, my parents let me do that. It's so funny how, how we, like, let our children do things. So, one hand, my dad was like, don't you fucking open the door. Not like that. But, like, then the other, they're like, go have fun with your friends in the dark and play manhunt. Cool. This time I realized the voice was too deep to be a kid. And when a voice yells out, we need help, Chance. obviously that'll always be slightly Why these concerning. Are tingling. Let's go check it out. I was getting a little <laughs> bit uncomfortable now because now I was questioning if these yells were directed at me. Now I heard the voice yell, straight in front of you, please come help us. And that oh, voice was coming no. from straight in front of me in the woods. No, nope. I'm sorry. Now I, I had a feeling this was directed no. at me. Don't I Not reluctantly me. called back, who is that? Nope. And they responded, Doesn't matter. we just need help. We're stuck in the woods. I will call 911 for you. Back, I'm going what does inside. That mean? Bye. There you go. And the That's voice fair. replied back, just please come help straight nope. in front of you. Incorrect. I got out from my seat. No. Nope. Walked down the steps of the deck no. onto the grass 
and proceeded towards the woods. At this point, you're at. I called out, Just I'm coming, where are you? Put yourself the on a plate. The voice replied instantly, plate. right in front of you, I see you. <gasps> I replied back, wait, are you alone or with someone? This sounds like skinwalker behavior. There was no answer this behavior. time. Uh -huh. I stopped in my tracks about halfway towards the woods. I had a bad feeling in my gut about this. Now? I started walking backwards, back towards the house yeah. and the deck. Yeah, it's time. I didn't even want to turn my back to the woods because it took me that long That's to realize fair. there but was they can something sneak up very on you suspicious on about side. this situation. I made it back to the deck, and the voice didn't say anything else. Ooh, transition. They truly it's saw me, and this was real. They would have said something like, where are you going, at the very least. They knew I was onto the situation, but who even knows how many people were in there? Mm. Could have been one, could have been three. All I know is getting stuck in the woods makes absolutely no sense, especially if he or they were able to literally see me. Like what? Did their shirt there get caught go. on a branch? I went inside the house and locked all the doors just to be safe. I chilled in my living room for a bit, still high, and I think that's why I was more trusting at first. Or he could just be super high how and high and voices. relaxed I was. Yeah. Then though, I heard the voice again from outside. Oh uh, my god! Mm -mm. Definitely in the backyard and not the woods anymore. I heard splashing of water. Turns out that Aunt Patty, bitch Aunt Patty, actually just has like a bunker full of like just tortured souls oh my god your poor unfortunate souls in pain yeah in need uh-huh this was wanting to be thinner that one's wants to get that girl but do i help them no you don't uh-uh help <laughs> it could have been the pool or the pond i hurried to the window to see i didn't see anyone at first but then the voice called I see you with a laugh. I noticed him. It was one guy, at least one guy visible. He was hidden behind the pool on the other side. Oh and no. I could only see his head. Yeah, that's enough. It was just too dark to make out anything besides his dark medium length hair. Mm -mm. Dark medium length. Close the blinds hair. and tried to ignore it. Maybe he'd lose interest if he saw I wasn't entertaining him. He was probably a sick, deranged person who enjoyed messing with people. Probably. So I didn't want to give him what he wanted. But my breaking point was when there was a horrible, aggressive banging on the window. What do you want from me? I had just closed the blinds. And on the other side, the guy was screaming, help. I screamed at the top of my lungs to fuck off, you freak. The police are coming. Nice. I screamed it over okay. and over, trying to make myself sound crazier than him. I heard him start to laugh on the other side of the glass. Yeah. You His laughing started before, to fade away yeah. as I assume he walked away. I sat back down on the couch, trembling, shaking, out of breath. I sat there for a while, and it seemed like the guy had really given up. I still got a good night's sleep that night because weed helps me sleep. I wonder huh. if I would All have right. handled that situation any differently if I wasn't high, though. The situation made me more paranoid about who I opened my door to. Okay, at least it's a, it's a, it's a lesson learned. Um, but I would always be like, just thinking, what if? Oh, know, yeah. Like, what would have happened? I'm 23 years old, and I live at home with my parents still. Okay, so you're a full One day adult. they were both not home, and I was outside playing basketball so in the better. front Let's yard. At some point while I was playing, I looked up at one of our upstairs windows and saw a woman standing no, there. No, fuck. Not my mom, no. not my sister. Uh-uh. It was a random woman. Nope. I guess when she saw me looking at her, she dipped away from the window. When I went inside and upstairs to check the lounge room, she wasn't anywhere. Wow. I checked every single room, room I could. Every bedroom, the bathroom, every closet. Then I checked the downstairs, which included the living room, kitchen, dining room, one bedroom, and more closets. Finally, I checked the basement, and I highly doubted she could be down there. It's a small basement with a couple couches, a bar, and two closets. There weren't many places for someone to hide, but when I opened the second closet door, I was incredibly scared as I didn't know of any other places someone could be hiding in the house. This was the last unchecked spot that <laughs> I could it, think of. I thought of. bourbon was a part of the living room. I left the door open <laughs> as if I were ripping off a band-aid, and like I did with the closet before this one, I right away pushed myself into the closet just in case that woman okay. was in there and I'd have the jump on her. But all I pushed myself into was a bunch of coats and coat hangers. I was so confused. Ghost. 
goes. I wasn't going to question my sanity, though. She's in the further. I definitely saw that woman, and I knew it. It wasn't the kind of thing you would just so vividly imagine. I went back to the middle floor and screamed very loud that whoever was in the house needs to get the F out. I actually screamed so loud that our next door neighbor came over and asked if I was okay. I told him that I literally just saw a woman at our upstairs window yeah. watching me play basketball. He came in and helped me search again. When we couldn't find her, I was left to assume that she snuck out through the back door, which I did unlock, after all, when I went to grab the basketball from the yard. So my neighbor left. I locked all the doors, called my parents, and told them the crazy story. And they weren't too thrilled. Did you see them again? They asked me to make sure nothing was stolen. I did just that. And luckily, it seemed anything that was worth something was still in place. I think we got a ghost so on our hands. now fast forward to or that this night. this is that frogging shit. I went to sleep after <gasps> checking the house one more time oh just for God. peace of mind. It was hard to fall asleep, though. My mind was racing for obvious If y'all don't know about frogging, I think it's called frogging. Is it frogging? Yeah. It's about with the pH. There's something else that I was thinking of, but I don't think that's what that was. I can't explain it on stream. Okay. It's it's a sexual act, so I'm I'm gonna be good. Um, anyways, frogging is I believe when a person sneaks into your house, um, but they don't really steal anything. They kind of just live there. Yeah, they live in the walls and shit. They live in the walls. They live in a, a space that you won't see them in. And like while you're out, they'll probably come out and just like Sergio, not the other F R word. I think I know what what you, I think you caught my gift. Um, and yeah, they would just live in your house without being seen. It's reasons. Most people can't relate to seeing a stranger at their window inside of their house. But my restlessness helped me out in this situation, and here's why. I was finally starting to drift away slightly. Then I heard some noises from the other side of me. Oh, no. I had the fan on above me. So the room wasn't dead silent, and that's why I didn't immediately turn to my other side at the first sound I heard. Okay, good. But at that the point, sound I just started frozen. to sound human-like. Okay. I turned to my other side. Like what? And there she was, getting out from under my bed. <gasps> she stood up tall above the bed, and I screamed so loud, louder than earlier before. I jumped out of my bed and tackled her to the floor and oh, had shit. my hand around her throat, asking her who she was. My doorbell rang, my neighbor again. I picked the tall, dirty-looking woman up off the floor and dragged her to the front door with oh, me shit. as she struggled and scratched She's at me. She's literally like I about still to like two scars on my right arm from her Finish claws. Her. I opened my front door to my neighbor again, and he let himself in and helped me restrain the woman. This was when I called the police. The whole time we waited for the police, the woman was screaming and cursing at my neighbor and I, threatening us too. The best way to put it, she looked and acted like a meth head currently suffering from withdrawals. When the police arrived, one the of the officers knew exactly the who the woman was. They had dealt with her multiple times before. Multiple times! Her name was conveniently Karen. It was satisfying to watch her be brought into Karen. the back of the police car. I let my neighbor know how grateful I was for him coming so quickly to help. And that night, my mind continued to race. No. Instead We're of being shaking. completely freaked out, which I still was a little, I felt this overwhelming feeling Welcome of new subscriber. Welcome new subscriber, Maddie Rucker. I can't fully explain why. Oh, that Lord Almighty! That got me in the mood. That got me in the spooky ooky mood mm. for sure. Um, again, that is Mister Nightmare, and that he will forever be able to kind of give me the heebie-jeebies. Um, what do you think? Fuck. I like, I can't say how terrifying the concept, especially like this last one of someone just being inside your house the whole time is. Yeah. I, I kid you not, when like, when you used to work overnights and I would be home alone, even with bourbon. Oh, wait. Yunina, hello again, sweets. Just saw it's y'all's two year anniversary. Thank you so Thank much. You. It's not our two year anniversary. We're going on five years, but it's the channels. We're, go we're past years. five years. Oh, yeah, yeah. No, yeah, we're, go we're going on six years. Yes. There we go. Um, I, I would check every closet behind every door. I had, like, an order that I went through the house where I would, like, eliminate places if someone was, like, sneaking around going to somewhere where I had just checked. Yeah. 
That's fucking terrifying. I can't. It's scary. Um, Max says, what is more terrifying, ghosts or living people? I personally think it's... I think it's living people. I think, I think it's people. more scary when you realize it's actually a person that has been doing shit all the all the time, the whole time, the whole time. Mm -hmm. All right, y'all want to get into the quarry? Yes. Woo! All right, let's get into it, y'all. We are going over to the gaming setup. We. All right. Potato, if bourbon freaks out at something, run for your life. See, well, all right. Now that's a little more complicated. That's a little more complicated. Bourbon barks at, like. Oh my god, hated. Damn, Sergio dropped one album and suddenly too good to remember how long you've been together. I know, no, I know, I know. It was just a little, a little glitch in the system. Mm -hmm. Anyway, um, what were we saying? You were talking about bourbon and oh, how yeah. he can't hear. So Bourbon is deaf, um, so he is very reactive to things that change, like, in his sight line. Um, so that means that, like, if a light shifts outside, barking. If he sees me, like, I have this little wine cabinet in the corner that has mirrors in the back. So if I'm walking around the kitchen, he'll see my reflection, barking. Oh, no. We're experiencing some technical difficulties. How did we do this before? I want, I really hate to say it, but I think last time we had to restart the computer, which I do not want to do. <laughs> oh, let me try unplugging the mouse and plugging it back in. Maybe that'll do it. Okay. We're having technical issues. Bear with us. Let me, let me, um, let me entertain y'all. <laughs> I wish I knew music. When did it end? Oh, thou enjoyment. I'm sad again. Don't tell my boyfriend. Beautiful. It's not what he's made for. Did it work? Oh, God. It's okay. Oh, God. Cody to the rescue. Cody to the rescue. Such a geek says, what are your boys going as for Halloween? Well, we're trying to come up with a list of things to do because... Um, for Halloween, we kind of want to do, we kind of want to dress up every week for the scary streaming Sundays. Um, so hopefully that is something that we can do. But if you guys have any ideas, one idea I have is to be Winnie the Pooh and Piglet. Um, but we were going to save that for like once we do um, Winnie, the, Winnie the Pooh, Blood and Honey, because we haven't seen that movie yet. I fixed the computer. No, we want to do like cute Winnie the Pooh and Piglet. Not scary Winnie the Pooh. Marcy, aloha from Maui. I finally joined at the right time. Your Scream Queen season two reactions were amazing. Can't wait for more. Thank you so much. Hopefully everything is okay. It's that area, right? That's like really bad. Mm -hmm. Hopefully everything's okay and you're being safe. Thank you so much for uh, reacting. Reacting. Thank you so much for watching our reactions. Stay tuned because we got more of that. Oh my god, now we need the Buddha. Oh my god. No. Oh, I can do the controlly now. You can do oh, the controlly. No, today, Cody, since we're not doing Outlast today, we're doing just the quarry. Cody is going to take the reins for right now. Yay! Up until we switch maybe like halfway through. Cody, take the wheel. <laughs> Now, if you don't know, Cody has um, chaos energy when it comes to this <laughs> game. Sometimes he'll just choose. Well, me, I'm considerate and I, you know, try to like break things down. It's very weird. It's like he doesn't, he breaks things down for horror movies, but not video games. 
George got to chapter seven. Where are we? Uh, oh, chapter, chapter six. six. Okay, good. Prayers by nine. Ooh. <gasps> Our prayers are answered. Come Here we go. Here we go. Oh, just what I need. Oh my God! Wait, I. I need to show you show you this guy's pictures because he is hot in real life. Emma, is that you? Is it Emma? Yeah, because how many times have I just been like, Sergio? Oh my God! Look at his back. Do you think everything is just like accurate? Like every single follicle that's on his body? I just need to know. I can't go that way. I'm asking for a friend. <coughs> and that friend is me. Tall Asian chick. Okay. Listen, I don't think he's that tall, but still. Oh, and as usual, um, if we are about to walk past a tarot card and miss it, uh, please let us know. Yeah, let us know. Because we'd be bad at that. And we don't want the old lady who we love to be mad at us. Yeesh, I'm gonna fall off this. Emily, thank you so much for joining. You're gonna be lurking, totally okay. Have a, you have schoolwork to do. Well, good luck with that. And thank you for the luck because we're gonna need it. Mm -hmm. Goal is to try to, I guess, make everyone survive. Nani over here, back rolls. Okay, but like, oh my God. What size feet? Well, that bodes ill. Fucking hell. Welcome to my life. Oh, welcome the wolves to the stream. We are playing the quarry. We are in chapter six. And we're starting off strong with a man with a nice back. You can tell he works that out. All right, such a geek says, as a tall guy, is there a reason why people love super tall dudes? Um, I'd like to understand that too. Well, as a fellow tall person, Cody is tall and I am short. So, Ooh. <gasps> memory card? What the fuck do we have here? A memory card from a broken and dirty camera. Guess what else is broken dirty? Maybe there's something on here. Aiden, he got a little splooge on his face. We've oh all been God. there after cruising by the pier. Oh no. Oh no. Okay. Mark C says, I like tall guys because I can climb them like a tree, but I'm tall myself. Oh, so if I may ask, how tall are you? JP, 6'4! And the first thing people say about me when they see me is, wow, you're tall. And I'm like, thanks for letting me know. You should use that. You should use that. I should use that. Not a lot of people say that you're tall. Probably your parents say it. Well, I feel like people that we have like mostly just talked to online say that because <gasps> it doesn't. No, you're such a geek. You're six eight. That's tall. And you like tall people? Wow, you're tall. Oh my god. I looked it up. The actor who plays Jacob is five five eleven. Oh, maybe not that. Okay, so he's not. I think five eleven is pretty much six feet. So. <gasps> but ass, 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 ass. <laughs> hey, then. <laughs> Are any of these tall guys here in sickle? Ask it. Listen, at the horror bandwagon, you can also treat this as a dating site, apparently. <laughs> oh, God, Emma. Ah, oh, Jesus Jacob, Christ. Scream King. Scream King. Startled, you scared me. Am I glad to see you? Yeah, I'm delighted, right? I oh guess my god, so. no way. Am I glad to see you? <laughs> <gasps> oh, Jesus Christ. Ah, you left me that back That bulge there, was you bulging. Asshole. I needed a Emma, little bounce, but that's fine. What the fuck is going on? Look, I don't know, okay? Some like bear attacked Nick and Abby back there. Yeah, me too, but it definitely was not a bear. What? Who? When? Why? How? And how? Just, uh, I'm glad you're okay. Yeah, barely. I mean, the thing that attacked me at the treehouse was like... What? It was like what, Emma? Like, out of a horror movie. 
You're a lot more calm than okay, what you just um, experienced. Well, it, it was probably just like a, a bear trying to defend itself. You oh, know? don't be a dick. You, you know it wasn't a fucking bear. No, you're right. You're right. And now we have these fucking the, the hunters running all over the place. So that's a fun new wrinkle. Crazy Meg T. Guys, I just joined the Discord. What is the category that everyone normally uses? Because there's so many, like, where that picture that Hayden did of Cody. Um, so, Crazy Meg T, I believe, Hayden, correct me if I'm wrong, it's under music, um, I think. Let me just double check because I have a phone. Um, da, 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 da. Someday my prince will call. Someday. No. I thought I was already here. I, can't, I used to do like operatic voices. Yeah, it's, so it's music. It's under music. Um, and we use personal chat. You can go into under general, movies. You can use any of those channels and uh, talk it up. Hold up. All five album covers? What? Yeah, all five album covers are <laughs> music. Five album covers? Girl, I need to. I need to go. I need to go see that. Imagine we just stopped the stream. We're just like, <laughs> all right, bye guys. <laughs> all right. They did this to me. That's a lot of blood. Yeah, well, it's not mine. Mm, got quite the funky bouquet. No offense. Um, okay. Damn, girl. Okay, we've got to get out of these woods. Yeah, no shit, Sherlock. You know that there's like you animated know, porn of these You don't have Jacob to be a dick there. about literally everything. Shit, sorry. Hey, I'm trying to keep us alive. Maybe he needs to be a little like, cause she, I feel like she enjoys a little assertiveness. All right. <gasps> Wait. Let's stop. embrace our inner toxic masculinity. Stop. Okay, yeah, choose defensive, sorry. I thought I heard a uh, bourbon yelp in his sleep. Cause he's, he, hey. um. I'm trying to keep us alive. I've been doing he pretty good by myself. Dreams. What? I don't need you to rescue me. Fuck. I'm not going to suddenly fall in love with you just because you're my knight in shining armor. All right. Sorry. You know, Sorry. I'll leave it up I to you. I wouldn't be surprised if you set this all up. <gasps> oh, my God. Wait. What? Set up a fucking monster to come get you? Run, 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 please, 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 please. Get ready, babe, get ready. Oh God, oh God, oh God. Oh God. Oh my God. Yes, yes, oh, no, oh, no. <gasps> Sorry. Oh. Sorry. Does Jacob literally be like, I'll be right back. Oh, oh fuck. God. Oh god, oh god, oh, oh god, fuck. oh god, oh god, oh god. I trust you. What is this? What is this? Bunch of bear traps. Fuck, 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 fuck. Yo. The man speed. Oh, oh, fuck, no! Fuck. Shit! Oh, shit! Oh, Why weren't you looking? Oh, fuck. Fuck. Oh. Oh, fuck. Oh, oh. Ooh, okay. Oh, that shit. is a missionary oh. position look. Uh. Uh. Look, you could. Oh. 
have updated. Okay, maybe we didn't stray along for too much. That's okay. Hayden, he could pry me open. Oh, <sighs> my God. Is she like one of those hunter dudes? Austin oh, works. So. We've been missing your comments. I forgot that happened, gross. Um, I feel like we should make our compassion net. Okay. You okay? I don't know who that other girl was. I've never seen her before. Me neither. But her? Yeah. <gasps> Wait, you know her? It's Kaylee Hackett. Mr. H's daughter? I thought she went home with her brother. No. Kaylee. The gag. Yeah. I thought so too. Wait, so is she? Oh, man. A werewolf? She's a werewolf. Nick. I think they're all werewolves. You smell so good. Oh. 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 Get it together, girl. Get Intervene? Intervene. Let's intervene, girl. Or maybe not. Like it, maybe dial it back a bit, huh? Fuck off, Caitlin. No. Uh -uh. Oh, no, she does not look good. She does not look good. Nick, what are you? I want to taste you. <gasps> oh, hey. God. Oh, God. Come here, huh? Oh, Nick, what the hell? Back uh, off. Get off. Oh, watch out. I said get off. Nick. Is there gonna be like wolf spain or something in that pool? That's Dude. pretty sick if it is. Oh my god. Comfort Abby. Hey, hey, it's no, okay. no, no. I'm okay. I got you. I got you. What did I do? Okay, Drew Gulak says, Drew, you've been coming in clutch before. Don't I, shoot, trust me. I don't know. Let's get him in the pool house. Dry him off. The thing is that they haven't picked up on the fact that, like, the bikes may be turning people. I totally forgot about that. That's so crazy. Oh, Raina says, dogs who have, like, rabies hate water. Just try to rest. Could be the same with werewolves. Interesting. I've heard that, that that's, like, a, um, a okay. symptom that humans have, too, if, they're, if they contract rabies, is they can become phobic of water. Shit. I mean, I hate oh, quit moving so water. much. It's pretty clean from what I could tell. I mean, it's not bleeding, but you need to see a doctor. Hey, Lance. See you in the chat. You guys are brave to play this. Girl, we're stressing. I love this game. This but is I'm all I've got left from the nurse's station. Ooh, fun. You better hope. Uh, we also, just the overwhelming pressure out. of keeping Jacob and Caitlin be and Emma alive because those seem to be the faves. For the police. Yeah. Dead girl in the pool that needs some explaining, huh? Easy, man. I mean, like, photos, whatever we can. I've got a funny feeling the cops are not going to want to believe any of this crazy shit unless we've got some hard proof. From now That's on, fair. That's fair. if you got your phone and you see something, take a photo or a video or whatever. Emma yeah. got one. Emma got one because we chose that. Mm -hmm. You okay over there, Abby? Look, why don't you look around and see if you can find anything to help make Nick more comfortable? Okay. All right, we're playing as Abby. Okay, let's Ooh. check out. Oh, let me check something. Okay. You just go to settings. Just yeah. want to make sure because I didn't double check like the the graphics. Go to graphics. Uh oh yeah, I forgot. But I think that's the the same ones as last yeah. time. So all right, just wanted to make sure. We can go back. Okay. Remember your tarot cards. Yep. I will remember my tarot cards. Sorry, tarot, you said? Yep. Tarot cards. <laughs> Too much to bear. Thank you so much. All right. Nothing in this toilet. Nothing in this toilet. If you hear a crow, a cart is nearby. Well, <gasps> fuck. What? Is that I true? I heard a crow when Jacob was running. I was trying to... Oh, shit. What? Well, how are we going to stop by for a for a card. Well, I think it was before he was like running, running. Oh. 
Cubby holes. Wasn't there a vision where Abby gets? Yeah. Ooh. Yeah. Unfortunately. The hermit, I believe. No, we picked the devil. Devil without restrictions. Replay vision. Oh, that's. That's either in the cabin or in the bathroom. It is in the bathroom. Look at the tiles in the back. So if she picks up the gun, she dies? Yeah. Okay. I'm assuming that's what the don't shoot was referencing. All right, let's check out this toilet. Nothing. Okay. Girl. What are we trying to do? So just like make him feel better? Yep, we're trying Maybe to some find towels. Oh, oh, hello. I wonder where Caleb is. Caleb's a, a recent piece of camp history. A younger Ryan enjoying his time at camp with Chris Hackett's kids, Caleb and Kaylee. Hmm. He I knows. Still, he I knows. I still am Ryan is feeling like he, Ryan knows more. I also think he might secretly be a werewolf and he's just like keeping it inside. He just knows how to. Maybe he's found a cure or something. Well, because remember, we saw that picture of him, of someone who looked a lot like him with a very young Chris Hackett. Yeah. I don't know. I don't know. Skeptical. All right. Cubby. Just as long as Jacob, Abby. Oh, Abby, too. So those are like the main people that we're trying to keep alive. Everyone else is oh, fair game. This place. Oh, among the miscell, miscellany, miss yeah, along the miscen <laughs> miscellany of these forgotten belongings is a scribbled drawing of a woman in the woods. Those ghost stories seem to have really left a mark. It was so different, like twelve hours ago. That's true. It it was looking so beautiful before, like it was the it was the dawn. Not the dawn. The dusk? No, not the dusk. The dawn. So they said, check every stall. Check every mountain. Check every stall. Isn't Dylan Ryan's boyfriend? Uh, <laughs> we're trying to make Dylan Ryan's boyfriend, but Ryan doesn't really want it. So, like, I don't know. Dylan is also another one that I guess all the characters check all them stalls. Gotta check all the stalls. Let me move this a little bit your way. There we go. Get the tarot card. Fuck yeah. All right, at least I found one. Okay. The moon. How poignant. Tonight of all nights to harness your fear and anxiety <laughs> and turn them into intuition. If you can do this and plan ahead, your cunning might just save your life. Beautiful. Thank you. All righty then. Connie, we have to make Tarot Grandma proud. We do, we do need to make her proud because she yells at us. We didn't get a single card last time, uh, one time. And she was like, what the fuck are you doing right now? Get your head in the game. She's and like, I was like, I can't help you if you don't help yourself. You bitches need to get this shit together. And I was like, all right, you're right. Wait, isn't this the whole of like, oh, did we check over there already? We did. What? I don't get it. Then, okay, we need to check everything. Well, I, I have a feeling like the stall, we were like we were supposed to find the tarot card in the stall. Oh, okay. All right, so I know there's people in the chat that are saying like no one is spoiling and there's spoilers and stuff like that. Uh, yeah, don't tell us obviously like straight up what's gonna happen if something happens, but little hints here and there that could help us, I think is fine. Yeah. Right? Because we wanna also like survive, right? Then we could do another run through of like, maybe we just choose bad decisions. Plus um, I love hearing uh, about what like the tarot cards can sometimes mean. In yeah, so like Hayden, the moon card tends to re represent deceptions, hinting that Ryan is shady. Okay, so that might be something. All right. But we'll, we'll, we'll take it with a grain of salt. 
now. Am I missing? Like, where is the thing for me to keep him warm? And so uh, my dog turned on the heated blanket and was sleeping on it. Smart puppers. Aww. Yeah, look. This is actually Cody's favorite way that bourbon sleeps mm -hmm. with just like one arm out. Because yep. he looks kind of like a human. Like when he when he does this on our couch, he will like drape his arm off the side. Like he's just like living his best life. And he's I love just it so, so comfy. much. He's so comfy. He loves that bed. A any other bed, he does not like. He won't sleep. Maybe we need to like just be like, hey, we fucked up. You don't know how to help you. Oh, we needed to just move it forward. Thanks. Hey. Well, he's not looking good, sis. No, look at those veins in his eyes and his face. Yo, something is not right with that boy. Yes, Brennan's on deliver that really line. <laughs> Did you see how he freaked out in the water? Yeah, he was like a, he was like a fish out of water. Baby, oh. there's a uh, shark in the sure. water. You know, something was weird when I tried to clean his wounds too, at the lodge. What do you mean? Well, all of his clothes were bloody, but I couldn't find where he was bit. I don't trust Or Ryan. scratched or whatever. He just kept moving around like he didn't want me to see how badly he was hurt huh mm, rabies he's not frothing in the mouth yeah i think abby would well i also think rabies <laughs> takes like a long time to set in in humans yeah, isn't aquaphobia a symptom maybe that's rabies? incorrect that's something that we're like figuring out hydrophobia yeah but i think it's more about a fear of drinking not just getting wet oh. this was like like my he has an answer for everything that's true that's true yeah which is not sketchy when it's me, but it is sketchy when it's him. <laughs> Welcome to my Ooh. nightmare. Hello, Johnny. Is it Johnny yeah. the Killer? <gasps> it's Johnny the Killer. <laughs> Welcome, We've Johnny. Been waiting. Of course. Johnny, just be prepared to be Johnny. like thirsted at in the chat. Hello, Cody and Sergio. Hello. We played you yesterday in Texas Chainsaw Massacre. All right, so we should be calm, yes? I really enjoy spending time with you. I don't know what's going on. Yeah, we might upset him. I feel like we should no. go. Please, just tell me. Okay, I need to fix this creaking, because this is I've bad. really enjoyed spending time with you this summer. That's such a, oh, such a, oh, Such oh, what? Oh, oh, baby, babe, babe, I don't like it. Such a cop out answer. <gasps> We're making Maybe. her like two. Uh, what? I've got something to ask you. Uh, yeah. Okay. Why don't you like me, Abby? <sighs> stop, 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 stop. No, no. Maybe we need to, maybe we need to like have her be a little more assertive and be like, get on with the program. Or maybe that's going to make him even more angry. That's the thing. I'm feeling like we should not make him angry right now, but I'm also worried that like, what if I'm afraid what that if Abby like, is not gonna. She's like, I do like you, and he's like, all right, well, join me in eternity. And be like, wha? But like, eat her or something. Oh my god, do we want to point to the chat? No, these okay. are big ones. We got to do them ourselves. Okay, I'm doing this. All right, we're gonna make decisions, Nick, guys. I do like you. No, you don't. You don't like me, don't do you? What do you mean? Tell me the truth. I am telling you the truth. God. I sure know how to pick up. What? You're not really very smart, are you? Oh, oh no. Stupid Abby. Oh no. Stop. Easy pickings. Oh, right off the bone. Oh. This isn't you. I mean, this this isn't you. I <gasps> Oh! Oh shit! Whoa! Whoa, Abby! Oh shit! Abby, everything okay? What do you mean everything? Oh, she literally was thrown! He's done. He's done. He's done. Oh my god. Are we gonna see a transformation? Oh god, what do we do? 
Oh. Okay, it said don't shoot. Don't shoot. We're not gonna shoot. We're not gonna shoot. We're not gonna shoot. We're not gonna shoot. But we're gonna hope. Please, 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 please. Oh. Oh god. Oh god. Oh no. Oh no. No, I we're will, not. We're I not will, gonna listen anymore. No, I will also say in my defense, in oh, we can use life to try to save her. Should we use a life, guys? Should we use a life? I also thought that she was holding the gun when it happened. I thought, yeah, I thought, I thought we would choose not to to get the gun. All right, save her. Let's save her. Use a life. I'm glad that they give us little lives. Okay, cool. All right. Drew is acting very silent in the chats right now. Oh no. Drew Chad, is very be <laughs> Don't be too mean to Drew. Oh, oh, Abby. Alright. Abby, Abby, What's okay? happening with her hair? I know, oh, there's a lot going on. Well, that was traumatizing, uh, guys. Okay, we're gonna try this again. because it got shot. Oh. Okay. Guys, that was traumatizing. That was like sincerely traumatizing. <laughs> All right, never trusting the chat again. Yeah, that's what JK, we get. We that's still what love we get. You. We still love you, chat. We still love you. That transfer, they just like blow up. Oh, interesting. Greg Nolte says, be warned that sometimes when you use that to save a character, you will go far back in the game when you made a choice that caused them to die. Interesting. All right, we got to trust our instincts now, babe. Okay. We got to trust our instincts. So, if I were a counselor at an off-season camp, partying around a bonfire and it started to rain and though i do want to go with one rule i think that I it seems to work work if you don't see something don't shoot if you do see something shoot so in that respect we, we should have shot mm -hmm. only one left wonder what the the, the path updater means. Well, that probably means that if we didn't pick that up, we wouldn't be able to use it at some point. Yeah. Tall Asian chick, we chose what we chose. Move on. We're moving on. Good, good girl, <laughs> we're moving on. <gasps> oh, shit. So it does Playing start stories to the again. beginning of the... Beginning of the game. I had no idea kids were getting freaked out. Are we gonna go to the stuff? beginning of the game? All right. Well, this is gonna be our last time. We accept the consequences from now on. Yeah, we accept the consequences. <sighs> I 
The camper that wrote this must have had a change of heart and decided not to send this letter home. Ghost stories are only stories after all. It I wish says, we could be like, yeah. Hi, Mom. Camp is so fun. Mr. Hackett is teaching us so much about nature and being safe in the woods. My friend Josh said he saw a ghost. I think he's lying just to scare me, but I drew a picture of her anyway. She looks quite angry, but I think sometimes when people are angry, they are just sad instead. We're going sailing on the lake tomorrow. I can't wait. Love from Rowan. Also... Is it me, or is this the other cutoff where we saw that picture oh, in the thing? Oh, yeah. So who left this here and took the other piece back there? That's hmm? true. Hmm? Ryan, Wait, looking at you. Look at the... This letter matches the... Draw. Yeah, but look, we got it. We can't pick that one. All right. Back in the water. We're going back in. No, I won't let me. Oh, okay. This was what watching me play Outlast was like, y'all. I just walk around looking for everything, and trying every to find every corner. battery. JP Outlast was so scary. Yeah. All right. Oh my God. Two paths diverge in a wood again. I feel like I should not go that way. I just have a... A feeling. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. We should definitely look for tarot cards. We should. Um, because I feel like we dealt this chapter... Uh, I don't know how many tarot cards each chapter has, but I feel like we could get two. All right, all right, we're gonna shake it off. We're gonna shake it off. We're gonna be good. We're gonna be good. So, should I go back and look for the tarot card? No, probably not. I mean, we got one at least. We got one. I'm so nervous about going the wrong way. See, look, this is a dead end. Yep. Okay. Maybe other paths were dead ends too. I wonder what happens if you do reject the terror lady's uh, help. Well, she's probably like, well, I tried to help you, you stupid bitch. <laughs> Can we, oh no, I thought we were like gonna be able to duck under there. Nope. But there's also part of me that wonders like, is this like secretly timed that if we keep going the wrong way, like we get got. Where the fuck, fuck did? I thought I saw a person. No, don't you? Oh I'll shit! You and no. I've never done this before, Pop. Just do it fast. That's it. Is that Nick? Oh, God. Are we going to, like, disembowel him or something? Oh, no. Oh, I feel like I should not have run. <gasps> yeah. What'd that say? Reaction. Oh, I fucked up. Yeah, you fucked up. Oh. Oh, yeah. Oh my god! 
Fuck your drag. No, we probably used one of the fireworks in case we needed it later it's on. It's okay. Caitlin! Ryan! Abby! Thank God Emma was like fucking built to be a final girl. It doesn't feel safe. Why did you pick run? Um, Reaction? Yeah. Yeah, that's that's the achievement that we got. So apparently you get an achievement if you instantly react. <laughs> Abby? Tyrus, if you run, you activate its instincts and it will kill you. But good thing we did Ryan? have, it was Emma at least, who was able to like think on her feet or was prepared to have that firework. Some peace and quiet. We're moving on. We're moving on. Ziggy, well, regardless, you guys are doing great. Thank you so oh, thank much, you. guys. Thank you. I killed him. Again, this is first time playing this, so we we don't know what's gonna happen. I mean, dead people don't usually jump out of windows and run into the forest. I guess reassuring, right? Because like to like help Abby a little bit. Yeah. Abby, he was gonna hurt you. You were defending yourself. I, I don't. I don't know that for sure. Frank I do. says, "I just joined the stream. Can someone give me like a mini recap? No. Werewolves was you are happening. And we can look into the werewolves <laughs> are happening." Um, Emma got mad at Jacob. Uh, Jacob is still closeless, which everybody is happy about. Um, we just saved Emma, even though we probably used a firecracker that we needed later. Probably. And we accidentally killed Abby and then went back and unkilled her <laughs> and saved we her. We used one of the saves. However, we do not want to have any consequences by the game. Yeah. So we did have one, one save. And I think we should be allowed to do that yep. because it's our first time playing and we want to like really truly experience it. But now we lived and we learned and we are now trying. And we've laughed and we've loved. <laughs> and we are going to move onward to see a well, hopefully successful game. That definitely wasn't him. Frank, Man, oh, so a lot happened, yes. Uh, Wait, but I will say also, I do love that we got to see a kill though, because I do want to see what the kills are at some point, you know? Well, we can play this again and kill everyone. That's true. Or just look at a YouTube video that has all the kills in the, in the, in the game. Or we can play this some more. <laughs> oh, what about, what's the ex uh, exclamation points? Oh, that probably just means there's new things. So there's like updates to these paths. So we could like go back and see like all the all the choices. Oh, we so we made. just haven't done all the all that yet. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I, like yeah, yeah. looked over it. Yep. Oh Which, shit. Which if we were really being detectives, Where we probably should. Packet? But for the sake of our viewers. Well, Ooh. we can look at it. Afraid, go away. Suspicious. Who is it? I'm going with suspicious. Who's there? I need your help. Please. Who are you? We don't know her. My name is Laura Kearney. So? Wait, is wait, 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 that's the girl! From the uh, beginning! Yeah, there's a crazy woman with a gun killing people. I'm not killing people. Holy shit, you... Laura Kearney? You're Laura Kearney? Yes? You're, the, you're the girl who didn't show up and we you had to work extra. You were supposed to be working, uh, helping out in the nurse's office, right? And you never showed up? Uh, you and the guy, what's his name? Max? Yes, Max. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, Mr. Hackett said that you had changed your mind last minute. I, I think that we should. I think that we should listen to her inside. Oh, oh fuck! I'm gonna say. Mm. 
Because so she mm. didn't get bit. What if she got taken in by the hunters and they're like But they didn't get got by the hunters, they got got by the cop. Okay, but the cop is clearly with the hunters. Are right? we sure? Because they let that but he did say to go to the fucking hotel, yes. not here. Yes. Hmm. I think I trust her. All right. We're gonna do it. We're trusting people. We're trusting our instincts. Are you instinctual? Okay, okay. We're, we're, we're doing I'm gonna open the door slowly. Just keep your hands up, okay? Hands up, fucking okay. monster. You wanna look out the window, make sure she don't have a gun? She's gonna die. Oh! Uh, yes, Sal Connor. <laughs> yes, our bitch is here, girl. Oh, she's mad at us. Here oh. we are again. Uh, yeah. Just. You, me. She's mad at us that we saved a life. <laughs> you cheated death, Final Destination style. Why don't we take another look at what you've found? Oh, she's so pissed. She looks pissed. How many were there in this chapter? The moon, how poignant. Tonight of all nights, to harness your fear and anxiety and turn them into intuition. If you can do this and plan ahead, your cunning might just save your life. Now tell me, would you like to delve deeper into one of many possible yes. futures? Yes, mommy. I don't like how fucking serious she is in this little like spot where we choose. She's like. You go then. Top top. What the One fuck? Did, oh, we have to go back and watch the whole thing. Terribly exciting. We have to watch the unraider version. <laughs> Apparently, the next chapter is really long. Fuck. Well, I heard somewhere that the next chapters are just long overall. Okay. Uh, Taught Asian so, chick. Uh, Taught Asian chick. You said if the goal is to finish the game tonight, maybe we're gonna play till we're done. Tomorrow we're off. So. Mm -hmm. <laughs> All right, let's see the uh, big head old freak. No, I don't think so. They do like chapter two chapters of stream. I think we usually do, but we're kind of in the zone today. So I think we're going to try to do it if it's possible. If you guys if, if it's like eight more hours, then I don't know. Well, we'll see. I mean, listen, we have both had a long weekend so far, so we may end things early, but we'll have to see. We're yeah. we going to take it play by play. All right, let's replay the vision. This is the cop. Come on. Okay, she gets a button. She gets this. Takes his handcuffs. Let's herself out of oh, jail. Oh, okay, so the moon. Oh, no, I, we already read that. I, I mean, this is clearly a flashback because she has a bandage over her eye instead of an eye patch. I think that this is going to happen. We're well, going to go back in time and we're going to play. That's just my guess. So we're going to get to try to like play as Laura after she gets arrested. Oh, meaning like where sh where she goes. Back, back, okay. back again. So the moon, how poignant. Tonight of all nights to harness your fear and anxiety. So like to like scare you, but turn them into intuition. If you can do this and plan ahead, your cunning might just save your life. I think that that means that we are going to have to grab something a while before and it's going to come in handy later. Yeah, well, it kind of showed us, right? Mm -hmm. Like, it means like we have to grab that that vial or whatever needle. Um, but this is making me seem like, what if this is the bad guy still? Or maybe she doesn't know that yet. We'll see. All right, let's do it. You want to take over or you want me to keep playing? Do you want to keep playing? I would be very okay with keeping playing. Okay, you're having fun. Uh, Do it. I still get stressed out. Uh, why didn't you come? Where have you been for the past two months? We Jacob, this chapter was one of my faves, but this one, one is early. a bit longer. I feel the game goes quicker after that this That was point. our okay. mistake. Let's one night early. Erica Erlang, what makes you... <laughs> Listen... I, that's true. I don't know if we can trust her. <laughs> oh, yeah, we're doing a flashback. We're in a flashback! Uh, 
Jacob Young says, whoever is the better manipulator should be in control for this. Uh, <laughs> That's a discussion we don't need to have on stream. <laughs> She does have an eye patch. Oh, is he dead dead? Did we just see his like mangled face? Uh... Max. Hey. Oh, he's alive. Come here. Come on. Oh shit. I thought he was a goner for sure. Maybe he did kill the, the wolf. He's a bad guy. Okay, confirmed. He's a bad guy. Kids. So he's feeding them. He's taking care of them. Maybe he's the brother of of Chris. Yeah. Oh wow, these graphics are really good. These graphics. What have you done to Max? Shut up. You can't just shut up. Shut this up. This is an interrogation. Shut up. I ask, you answer. <clears throat> Name. Mm. I mean, if I was the writer, I would say angry, but that's just me. I uh, know. I feel like play along so I can gain his trust. Okay. Laura Kearney. Jacob Young says, "Shut up, his new was." And what is your relationship? Oh, for sure. Max Brinley, he's my boyfriend. Where were you headed last night? To Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp. You already know this. What have you done with Max? No. I ask, you answer. That's how this works. Maybe we're manipulated. Maybe it actually, he didn't kill him actually. Maybe he's still alive. Uh, uh, I'm not saying shit or fine. I'm gonna keep playing along. Okay, I mean, if that's your instincts, let's go with it. Fine. What do you wanna know? Oh. Well, uh, why are we going to Hackett's Quarry last night? Max and I are camp counselors. Oh, bullshit. Counselors aren't due until today. I told you, we drove up and got there early. We figured we'd just go to camp. Why didn't you go to the motel like I told you? Because we were, like, way closer to the camp, and... You're lying. We're broke. <laughs> mm hmm Intrigued. Okay, Sheriff. Hack it. Wait. Hack it? Like, Hack it. He's Chris the brother. Hackett? Don't change the I subject. I think he's the brother. What the fuck is going on here, man? You have no idea what's going on here. Not a goddamn clue. You just stepped in some grade A double prime. Go ahead and kill yourself cosmic type shit, young lady. And your only option is to buckle the fuck up and do what I say. Oh, okay. Do you understand? Yes, daddy. They even got the like the little follicles of his hairs. It keeps giving me angry. And I feel like I'm starting to feel like I should be angry at some point. I mean, so far he's being impatient. Which I forget if that's like it's gonna kill you kind of kind of vibes. Yeah, I'm gonna please. You just stop trying to intimidate me and tell me what the fuck is going on. Is is Max alive? I feel like I'm 
going crazy. Come on, dude. Let her know. Jacob Young says, I find it funny the way he's expecting you to lie, so he's thrown off when you what? tell him the truth. That's what I'm saying. I feel like we should not lash out. I just, I, I have a feeling. Okay. I got a Let's feeling. Go. Because if we, oh, hey. Maxi. Oh, he's also shirtless. Mm -hmm. Hey, you asshole. We, we, we were complying. Good job, on. Cody. Max. Good job. I know you hear me. I'm always so nice. I'm like, are you okay? <laughs> well, because inst instinctually, that's what you want to do, right? I feel like... <sighs> what would being dismissive do? That's what I'm saying. I feel like we should go this way. Unless being dismissive Max. is like, we're going to start making a plan together. Are you okay? Yeah, right? Like, screaming is going to help, but you know what would? Yeah. Screwing. I mean, I'm getting... I'm kidding. I'm, I'm kind kidding. of all mixed up, but more or less intact, I think. I thought his face was like Laura? devoured. Yeah. Why am I naked? What? Well, you got I mean, after on. we got attacked, the next <gasps> thing I know, I'm waking He's up in a jail wolf. cell and you're gone. And now you're back again. And, and, and I'm super naked and there's blood and stuff everywhere. Mm hmm. I mean, what the fuck happened? Oh, because he exploded. Yep. Yes. Got it, got it, got it, got it, got it. When I was hoping you might know he wanted me to confess. Confess what? B. A. A. O. O. Oh fuck! This is so tough. Um, well, what do you think? What is your thought process? So right now, I feel like I'm going along with the cop, right? I'm trying to like get on his good side so that I can grab whatever thingy that was that I stabbed in his. But are you saying he's being a little too? Because you don't want her to trust him. Yeah. Because now we now know that these wolves don't fuck around. I'm gonna say suspicious. Yeah. So our host was very keen on getting me to confess, but I honestly couldn't tell you what I was meant to be owning up to. Jesus. What he used to try to get you to talk, the pincher, the blade, three hole punch. No, it, he wasn't torturing me. Who does this guy think he is? Well, Sheriff of North Kill, apparently. North Kill? Yeah. Max. What? Did you even look at the map? Packet's Quarry in North Kill. That's the town. Oh. He doesn't know. He's... Oh. And it gets better. Mm. I gotta look at his name badge and... Get dressed. What's he giving you? Not gonna be the guest of honor at Fashion Week, I'll tell you that much. Hey, did I say you could talk to each other? Did you say we couldn't? <laughs> don't, oh. don't need your permission. We we are trying to get on his good side, right? You think so? We try. Okay. Oh, just sorry, to... sir. We'll be quiet. We will. Max. Hey, what'd you do with my real girlfriend? <laughs> Oh. <laughs> All right, but that was cute. That was cute. Hands through the bars. Come on. Because maybe he is good. I still don't trust him, but maybe he is good. Well, if we're going on this this theory of mine that Ryan is a werewolf and isn't telling anybody, and that's why he looked Your the turn. same in the picture with Chris as Let's a go. kid I'm not going as talk now. Right Come on. Hey. Hey. Get the fuck off! 
Come on. Move. He gets bit. Good boy. He gets bit, and we take the little needle to inject him, and he may maybe that's hey. the cure. Stop struggling. Oh, fuck. Calm down, Max. Max, calm down. You're only making it worse. Laura. I feel like there's something the inside me that is saying this might be work. Okay. See, I can't even speak English right now. Laura, I think there's got to be something in here you can use. I don't know. Laura's giving Final Girl. Okay. Let's see. Oh, what's this? Writing on the wall. Let's see what it says. While the town of North Kill lay there sleeping, the hag in the woods started weeping. As the bodies decay, the wolves hunt hey. their prey, and the sheriff continues his creeping. Who's driving? All right, what's what? this pain? This doesn't paint a particularly favorable picture of Sheriff Hackett, and perhaps this isn't the first time he's locked someone up illegally. It also doesn't seem like a very busy police station. Go towards the, the cell. The bars. Ooh. Get it. Let's see this. All right. Ah, the world. Often travelers' paths are direct, but sometimes it is not so simple. Sometimes they're intertwined with others. Compassion over anger. You'll need friends when you're going. It is not until we fall into the belly of the beast that we realize how perilous things can be. Also, she got a boob out. Oh, good damn for her. It. All right, girl. I was like, damn it. All right. All right, all right, all right. Let's see. All right, all right, all right. Do you want to go to the bed? Do we do the bed already? Okay. Sis. Not a chance. I need some sort of lever. Hmm. Oh, like little like from, thing to like squeeze it in there from the bed. A spring. Let's do it. Let's or a see. bar. Oh. Oh, is this what we will we grab in the vision? <laughs> that could work. Welcome to my. Oh. Hello, That's Tam B. Welcome. Ah, uh, yes. Looks like some Indiana Jones shit. It's just like everything like opens up. Okay. So good. I feel like we're gonna get something. I feel like we're gonna get something and then be able to hide it in there. Oh, okay. I wonder where, what he put him in. Maybe, maybe he's injecting him with something to keep him human. Maybe. I don't know. Watch it, man. I bruise easily. Not anymore, <laughs> you don't. <laughs> All right. Hey, the second we get out of here, you're toast, motherfucker. Ooh. Sure. Laura. Second you get out. <coughs> well, answer your question. <laughs> or aggressive. What's that supposed to mean? Bitch. I don't want to be fearful, but I also don't want to be aggressive. Yeah, they really know how to word these, so it's like, we're going to trick you. We're gonna wait, wait. Well... Answer your questions. You just can't lock us up in here with no goddamn explanation and expect us to be all butter and cupcakes, okay? Just work with us here. Butter and cupcakes? There's nothing to bargain with. Come on. Fuck. Come on! Oh, that means we gotta find something to bargain with. Like what? Hey, you can't just leave us in here! Hey! Come back! I'll never let go, Jack. I'll never get go. Oh no, I'm thinking about the time when she's whistling on the Titanic. She's like, Come Fuck. back! Come back! Come back! Yeah. Come back! 
Yep. Playful. playful. We're not being fucking playful right now. So how to go? Are you okay? It's just wow, a foot. Wow, serious. It'll heal. I meant the interrogation. Oh. Yeah. Can't break old Max. Many have tried, many have failed. I'm being serious, Max. He, uh... He just asked a lot of questions. A lot of weirdly specific questions about us and where we were going and why and how I was feeling this morning and... I don't know. Nothing I said made him seem any less annoyed. He asked how you were feeling? Yeah. Well, he didn't it, ask it's you? It's so hard because they don't know. No, no, no huh. she does know that there's a monster out there. Really? Uh, Wait, hold on. I hear a beat about to drop. Hey, hey, hey. Listen, y'all. Oh, hey, did here. you get a look at his In name badge? Quarry. It's all you fair. You mean it's not really Detective hey. Dick Whippet? It's Hackett. Dick Whippet? Sheriff Hackett. Peanut you butter butter pops. Chris Hackett? What is oh my it? my God, like the Chris Hackett? Yeah. Yunana, Who's hey guys, I'm going to head to bed. Have fun on my behalf. Thank you so As much for joining, Yunana. Camp Yunana. leader, Mr. Hackett of Hackett's Quarry. Have a good remember? night. Ooh, you know what? I also just realized Hackett's Quarry may not be named after Chris Hackett. That family could have been there for a while. Last night feels like a lifetime ago. The fuck does that mean, though? You know? Where we set up? Maybe it's some kind of crazy camp counselor kidnapping ring that's i mean what suspicious reflective wait why do you ask well that? i guess sheriff I Hackett's not exactly acting like a okay. typical kidnapper but he's not acting like a typical cop either well how do you know how kidnappers act I'm just trying to get us this out of here, and I can't me get us out of here until I have oh, some clue God, why yes. the fuck we're in here. I want to play that game again. Oh, I, I just really, said that the other day. I don't know. What if we yeah. can't make sense of it? What? Well, you we have to. You have to, girl. Sometimes things just don't make sense. After the quarry, we can what just then? play The Last of Us. That's true. We're just stuck in a backwater jail for the rest of our lives. Now. This isn't forever, Max. Cody's he, working off he intuition right now. can't just hold us here forever. He didn't seem too convinced of that. You gotta stay positive. You can't think like that. Why not? Might as well just accept it, right? No, fuck that. Fuck that. Think about the rest of the summer, Max. And school? I mean, I've been dreaming about becoming a vet since I was five years old. I'm not gonna <sighs> let this fleabag fuck face this stop me. This is gonna come in handy. We need Laura to survive. We're gonna get out of here. I'm gonna study to be a vet, and you're oh. gonna um. What? Do something with your life. I'm gonna what? And you're I gonna play video letter, games Max. and drink beer at Nobody home all day. At home. <laughs> Not college. For college. I found it in your bag. You were poking around in my stuff. I can't believe you didn't tell me. He's mad. I, I was embarrassed. But your grades were good and you wrote a great essay? Yeah, apparently not good enough. Fuck. You've been making plans, Max. What the fuck? I don't know. What do you want me to say? It's okay, unless he's going to Hogwarts. I mean, there's no Shrieking Shrek or Wompy sorry, Willow. Maybe, sorry I lied. Sorry I lied to you. Empathetic. I'm sorry, Max. It's, because you it's can't really say sucks. empathetic without pathetic. Half updated, hey, though. It's not the worst thing to happen this summer. Maybe we'll, she will want to keep him I'm alive. Sorry. I shouldn't have kept it from you. You know? We'll see. 
You know you can talk to Instead me about anything, like, right? Instead of being like, fuck you, loser. Right yeah. now I'm feeling like I should not be making any enemies. Yeah, I do. Max appreciates your sympathy. I keep thinking that the werewolves have feelings and that they'll be like, no, okay, I can't Okay, let's just do it. focus on getting out of here for now. Great, sign me up. You mean like how Abby didn't shoot the, the werewolf beginning. and then I killed her? Like yeah. from when we left home? I learned my lesson like the hard way. Like from when we ran into the cop. So after we ran into the... Whatever we ran into? Yeah. Actually, yeah, that's when shit started getting weird. Do you think it was a good idea to have lied to him? About hitting a pothole? Yeah. I don't know. I think he probably knew we were lying. He was acting really strange. What if he's not even a real cop? Well, he's gotta be dirty, but... I mean, I think he's a real cop. We're in a police station. I mean, yeah, but there's like... nobody else around. Yeah, that is concerning. Especially the whole hack it hack it thing. Let's just go with the idea that they're both in on it. Okay. So we're supposed to meet Chris Hackett at the camp, and instead... There's nobody there, and we get attacked by something, and then the cop shows up. Maybe that was Chris Hackett. That part's all fuzzy for me. The, the, the like, I remember the, the steps and and that smell, would be why like, wet fur and a he, they said a like you can't go there because the he's being Ian a werewolf right now. And yeah. the kid Ian. was killed and in the pool. I don't think it was a dog that attacked us. Whatever it was was big. Like, person-sized big. Yeah, it really did a number on you. Like, I'm surprised you're not more messed up. Like, like, like I vividly remember the thing's teeth ripping into you. Oh, things are piecing together. What is messed up about that is, Laura, I don't have a scratch on me. <laughs> Crazy Big T, yeah, I'm romanticizing what? the werewolves hey. a little bit. Okay, so weird question. Do you remember before we got lost? You got lost? Well, yeah, but before that, I was all like, "Not important right now." Whoa, look at the moon! <laughs> it's so big, so cool to see a full moon in the middle of the woods. And you were all like, "Yeah, no shit, Max. It happens once a month." Yeah. So. Right. So. Piece it together, you know, girl. Full moon. Yeah. What if? Uh. Okay. No. Stop. I'm just saying, you know, maybe. Welcome, IBS. It was a werewolf. Say it. <laughs> Are you out of your. I should have left. Goddamn mine. Werewolf. Oh my god, Seriously? that what fucking fuck? scared me. What? What? what that was what's a weird so transition. I said literally the exact same thing. Okay. Do you, you got anything better? I mean, like, zombies, aliens. Time you saw hopping your best Draculas. friend explode. <laughs> Ryan, oh my god, god! Shut the fuck up! Ryan, shut the fuck up. I would say, you want answers? Ryan, right? Oh! Yeah. You want answers? I've Get got it, answers. Get it, girl. Interrupt me again, you're on your own. <laughs> Ooh, girl! Whatever. She's an icon. She's a legend, and she is the Would moment. it really be so crazy? With all the shit that we've been seeing with Nick? With the thing on the roof? Okay, it would <laughs> really start to explain a lot of stuff. Dylan. I'm just trying to keep an open mind, okay? This is like your ghost stories. How is this so different from your ghost those, stories? Those are, those are just campfire stories. Like, there has to be a rational explanation for everything, for all of this. Okay, you were not talking so rational when you separated my hand from the rest of my body you told me to that's fair and if it's bite with which you're faced cleave limb from torso with great pace she knows shit she's what? got she's up here with the right poems thing. see do you think she, she got, got bit in the eye and she it. just took her eye out like uh no i don't think so <laughs> oh she got scratched though <gasps> oh and remember There's what the hunter all said this than you think wait i want to see just let me finish. She showed him her eye. You can decide for yourself if you believe me or not. I don't care. But I think you should hear all of it. <laughs> Ryan is delusional. Yeah, he's delusional. I don't know. I really don't trust Ryan. The next few weeks were long. Do we? Oh, and yeah, because they were there the fed whole time and in let camp. Us take showers. Shit. But aside from that, we barely saw him. Max and I, we talked a lot. 
as much as we could about what happened that night. It was like trading conspiracy theories. We talked about the cop, the camp, the accident, the woods, the thing in the basement, what happened to Max. We just kept going over it all again and again, and nothing was making sense. Until... All we knew is that we needed to get out of there. All we knew we need to get out. We... July 12th, Laura, North Coast Police Department. I can't take this anymore. It's not that bad. Oh, it's nighttime. You're probably in the same crap at <gasps> camp. No, I is can't this, oh, take this the same day? in and here anymore. Weeks. Oh. Yeah, well, that part's pretty tough. So the, it's the next. We've got to do something. We've got to get out of here. We need a, p a plan. We well, keep saying that, but it's been weeks, so mm. you know. Let me know if you have one. That's really not very helpful, Guys, Max. Guys, chat. I love your community you lighting up. Like, <laughs> what? Just the be like itty everyone. bitty tiny detail that I may or may not be a fucking werewolf, you Laura. Just keep it down. So what? What can we do, really? We run off into oh, the he's sunset, getting only to be stopped when. I turn into a nasty ass monster and kill you and eat you, and then I run off alone into the sunset with little bits of you stuck in my teeth. Okay, okay, stop. Just one problem at a time. All right, we, we don't even know if that's what's really going on, and we won't until we get the hell out of here. Okay. Well, it seems to me that we only have two real options. We can play nice and try to get this guy on our side. What, so he'll let us go? Or... That's what I've been doing, girl. We try to catch him off guard and make our escape. If he escapes, he will kill her. Yes. Well, we know that she does She does survive, but he could kill someone else. We've got to escape. What if we get on his good side? It's so, there's so many things that could happen because like that could make him angry. I do think, I mean, it's in the night of the full moon. I feel like if we escape, shit's gonna happen. Yeah. And, it, and even if we go that side, it's gonna happen anyways, right? Mm-hmm. I'm right, curious. I curious. Okay, so let's say we get on his good side. What then? Brunch and mimosas every Sunday till he sees the error of his ways? Yeah, I was being rhetorical. The dude doesn't have a good side to get on. I mean, he don't even talk to us half the time. I don't know. I think we could crack him. Laura, I think he's just biding his time until he can figure out a way to get rid of us. At least until... Permanently. Well, yeah, they don't know... Permanently. That's, I mean, that could be true. Escape is the only way. I think we should try. Optimistic, yeah. I think we should try. Well, because he's probably I mean, waiting he until now us, we'd be to figure out what now. to do with that. Yeah, what so if what's he, he just waiting opens for? it up and lets him kill her? Exactly. Look, we just... If this doesn't work, we try to escape. Deal? Yeah. Deal. So... All right, how are we supposed to get this guy to like us if he won't even talk to us? I don't know. I mean, he's got to have a weak spot, like something we can use. It's not like we don't have time to figure it out. Yeah. Okay. Hey, hey! T-Money! Can I call T -money? you T-Money? T-Money! Why? You can call me Officer Hackett. Boing. Hackett? Like as in Hackett's quarry? What's it to you? Just interested is all. Feel like we hardly know you. Well, let's keep it that way, okay? Oh, come on, Team Money, lighten up, man. No reason we can't be buds, right? I can think of seven. If we're trying to get on his good side. You're right. We've been just awful, and we really want to make it up to you. Is there anything I can oh, do, officer? The sheriff isn't buying I see it. what you're doing. Well, well because maybe work. we're trying too hard. You think we're just gonna be besties, and I'm gonna let you walk right out of here. Not gonna happen. Asshole! Max! We know what's going on! 
We know time. Max is a werewolf. <sighs> Stopped. Dead we'll learn in a few days, right? What? What then? No, ma'am. You don't know the half of it. Well, then, fucking tell us. Yeah, for real. Like, um, he, he, uh, there's just so much he's not telling us. I said, take your fucking clothes off. Fuck off. Get back! Ooh, That's he's what's not going on. Good. Oh, Get no. the fuck away from him! All right, the music's here. It's getting crazy now. Come here. What are you doing? What are you doing? Get off of me! Shut up! Shut up! Have a seat. She's gonna have to walk. Ah! Oh! Quit squirming. Said you want to be a vet, right? Call us an internship. Let me go! How do you know if she wants to be You're not going to believe it until oh, you cameras. see it for okay. yourself. Just fucking ask next time then, dude. That's Jeez. true. Just be... Don't get too close. G, come in. Oh. What's your position? Over. That sounds like a Dewey Shit. to me. It does sound like a Dewey. Mm-hmm. Just wrapping things up here. Nothing. You went for it. You went for it. On my way. I love Over. the instincts. Yeah, try. That was pretty stupid. I probably just fucked it up, but. Hey, you can't just leave me here. Yes, I can. Okay. Cool. <laughs> so I never had a chance to put something in the little brick. Yeah. I don't know what that was for. I think it'll come. I mean, there's a long chapter, I don't know. so maybe I feel like a lot I'm more. I'm just messing the shit up. No, it's okay. It's okay. We're doing good. Ooh. Ooh, clinical. Oh, wait. Do it. Yeah, I think we need to know. Max, tell me exactly what you're feeling. Laura, I, I don't feel so good. Not feel good, like how? Here. I don't know, just a little woozy here. Bad. Come closer, let me see your eyes. I think I better stay back. Max, I need to observe you. I feel you. that, that's like my feeling when I'm hungover, like, oh, hold on. Or I have too much weed and too much Is drinking. this fucking close enough for you, bitch? Sorry. Not I, the way that Sergio greets me in the morning. This fucking close <laughs> enough to you, bitch! Uh, <laughs> Max? Max? Tell me what's going on. Oh. Oh my well, god. This is bad. Oh, it's inflating. Uh, that's what she said. Or he? Oh. Like a sausage. Love the reveal. Guess who's back in the house? Oh. Oh. Oh my god, bitch, an eye for an eye! No. Look at her run, she's like, ow, 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 ow! She's like, bitch, you got my fucking eye! Ooh, wait a minute. Oh, yeah! Fuck! There goes my eye! Now I only see one with one eye! Let's get to this. I need help. Look at my boots. Look at that blood. Hey. Oh, whoa. So much for death. And that's where the, the, the scratch goes from. All right, well, she went back to where she was. She didn't run away. 
<laughs> Austin <laughs> works. Copyright coming game. for your wigs. Yeah, at this point, it is what it is. As long as we don't get a copyright strike, we're good. Oh, we're walking. We're walking. Okay. I'm going to attempt it. Nope, I can't go that way. Oh. I guess I can. Yes, you can. Oh, fuck my life, bitch. Oh. Gotta be careful. Okay. And we're going that way. Let's go. I'm gonna fucking look at everything. everything. Look at everything. Look at everything. Oh, 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 ooh. We saw that. Okay. There's a hag. I feel like this is the area where it's gonna happen. No, we don't want to sit down yet. We want to continue looking for sure. For sure. All right, well, let's go to the corner. Okay, we're gonna go back. All right. Uh, unfortunately, Connie is right. We actually are in the streamer mode music, um, and we still we still get them. We still get them, um, unfortunately. But luckily, it's like they're 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 kind of you know they just demonetize it. They don't um, they don't block the video. Everybody, cross your fingers. I did read up on it though. Apparently they were supposed to fix it, but I think they truly thought that it wasn't gonna be a copyright kind of thing. Okay. Yeah. What's he hiding? I heard noise. So did I. All right, let's do some exploring. Welcome everyone to Hydrogen Chicks 207, 207, 207 viewers. Y'all are growing. Ah. Thank you guys for everyone who's in the chat. Yes, thank you everybody who is currently here Max. watching us here for our lives. And I guess I can't leave Max. Can we try to go to the center of the room? That's what I'm gonna try. Or I could go back to my cell and wait, I guess. Huh. Huh. Did we explore every part of this? No. Okay. Well. Uh, we could try going upstairs. Nanny, my dad, my dog is hanging off his bed like bourbon. Oh. Fuck. I'm gonna need to D rest. Dubs, thank you so much for this. Uh, it's called oh. super chat. Super chat. <laughs> Crazy McT, we love you boys. Well, we love you back, guys. We love you guys. Potato, I'm gonna go. Oh. Mama's boy. Potato, I'm gonna go to sleep and we'll, I'll watch the rest of the stream tomorrow because I'm very tired and it's 3 a.m. Oh shit, yeah, go to sleep, girl. Bye, I love you guys and happy two years. Thank you so much, Potato. It's a screen, baby. Good night. Oh, there it goes. I wanna find this needle. I like how I like an accident. I'm I'm gonna find this needle. Well, I'm nervous. I'm like, what if this? Because the game has always given me lots of time to explore. But what if this time it doesn't, and I just don't find it? And then wait, wait, wait. fucked. Okay. <gasps> He's well, not a real cop. Can't be doing too well. Oh, no, it's a chard. Never mind. I thought it was fake. 
Ooh. The old sh sheriff's badge is badly fire damage. Does it belong to the current sheriff or one of his predecessors? This the body in the lake looks like it could be one of those missing hikers. Someone was clearly trying to hide it. But we can go back and like. Kaylee's dead. However happy they were once were, that's all changed now. It's highly likely that no swimming sign was less to do with the camper's safety and more about the discarded body hidden in the depths. I'm trying to sound like the Texas Chainsaw Massacre voiceover. If this was meant for the creature that attacked the radio hut, it may not have been very effective. That thing was fast. This drawing matches the letter found at the fire pit. Kids have the scariest imaginations. All right. Jacob Young said I'm good for exploring, so. You've just eased the Cody's. Strap in Cody. for the next hour. While we while we explore, how's everyone's night doing? What are y'all doing? Christina says, I caught up street finally. Yes, I love you both so much. Thank you. Oh no, can you scroll up on the chat? Sorry guys. Thank you for making a tough time for me recently better. Oh, I'm sorry you're having a tough time. Well, strap in C come hang out with us we, we are, we're so glad that it's, it's getting better um it is gonna get stressful here though <laughs> like, <laughs> crazy mcd i might have work tomorrow no but i'm in for however long the stream goes Ella, once again the voices are killing me oh i'm sorry that you have to work tomorrow but hopefully it's a smooth shift hopefully it's not too crazy sorry if you've been asked this before but any plans on opening memberships here <gasps> Silas, we have had uh, some talks about it. We have been talks about memberships. We're kind of sorting everything out because we kind of figured, you know, if you don't want to go to Patreon and like, you know, create an account and all that stuff, we figured we might do memberships. And that way you guys can have some out. fun little emojis and things that you can do in the chat. So I think we might be doing that very, very soon. Wait, you can still see her eye in the pause screen. <laughs> This is not accurate. I'm also like, I thought there would be a tarot card here. We already got one. Where? You already read July it. July 7th. I we did. Maybe not. I don't think we did. Birthday. His birthday is July 7th. Okay. Oh, no. Maybe we didn't. Okay. Would you like to read? Oh, this is the, this is the one that this we is just the one got? We just picked up. Yes. Okay. <clears throat> The chariot. At the reins of a chariot, we would all feel safer, taking control, relying on determination to make our choices valiant, but in some cases, foolish. Many seek refuge in chariots, but perhaps in some cases, they're not as safe as we think they are. Interesting that this chariot is being pulled by wolves. Oh. Interesting. How many times? Oh, we got 11 out of 22. And wow. I know we missed two before, like, way back. We still got some game to go. All right. I want to say that we're kind of at the halfway mark. <gasps> yes. This must be what he used to knock me out. Oh, maybe it's to knock them out. I was saying it was a cure. I can hide this in my cell. All right, let's go. Let's go. I am horrifying. Trying to find those John Stamos search straps. Are you sending us search straps? I know I saw that before. That'd be great. D Dubs. I'm surprised y'all don't have a cash app to get all your money. Doesn't YouTube take portion of super chats? Yes, unfortunately they do take a portion of it, and they do um, even memberships. They do take a portion of it. Um, unfortunately, Patreon doesn't take as much. I don't like that. Um, but maybe we'll put it in the description if y'all want to help us out, support the channel. So we Tips can keep are growing. never necessary, but always appreciate. Yeah. Yeah. No pressure guys. <gasps> what is that? Tell us. Toys and check your way past halfway. Okay. Too bizarre yet bonafide. Let me see. A letter instructing those behind the bizarre yet bona fide podcast. <gasps> and it's from the sheriff. It's from Sheriff Hackett. To stop investigating Hackett's quarry. 
Wait, 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 wait. So this is okay. I okay. Zoom in. I wish I could zoom in too. Maybe I can pick it up again and like pause it. JP, I've had the worst migraine today, but y'all have distracted me from it. I appreciate y'all. JP, sending you all the love. Okay. I had a migraine recently. It was the worst. So I totally feel what you're feeling. So hopefully it gets better. Oh, too bizarre yet bonafide. I, I let you read all that. No, no, I know. I know. I'm living. I live your fantasy, girl. Have your moments. Have it. <laughs> It has come to my attention that you recently released an episode of your podcast that features the town of Northkill and, more specifically, Hackett's Quarry. If I am to understand the context correctly, said episode investigates the mystery of a ghost in the woods, though the very idea of this is completely preposterous and, as I'm sure you're aware, no such thing exists, I am writing to tell you that the proprietors of Hackett's Quarry have expressed concerns that such unsavory stories, ooh, they use the British spelling, could be detrimental <laughs> to their various business Well, now avenues. you have to have a British accent. Oh, no. You don't want that. You don't want that. Cody's not confident with his accents, unfortunately. Including Hackett's Quarry Summer Camp, which prides itself on being a safe, fun environment for children from all over the country. Mm. It is with this in mind that I ask you to take down this episode of your podcast and refrain from releasing any further unsolicited publicity around Hackett's Quarry. The proprietors of said land would not be against seeking legal action if you do not comply with their requests. Please accept this letter as a formal request with the benefit of both parties in mind. Respectfully yours, Travis Hackett, Sheriff Northkill Police Department, Northkill, Upstate New York. Cool. Yes. We did it. Okay. I have exhausted this and myself. I need to sleep. I got it, girl, but we got more stuff to do. I'm not done with you yet. Oh, hold on. Tall Agent Chick, also, I haven't thought about my MRI res results, and I have y'all to thank for that. You and George from the Horror Hour. Oh. Well, listen, that that's so sweet. And, again, I told you this in this Discord, sending you all the fucking good vibes mm -hmm. and making sure everything's okay. Um, I'm glad that us and George can help out. That's what yeah. we're here for. Mm-hmm. Missing cats, missing dogs. Oh no, not the doggies. And, Radcliffe and the cats. And Edward Benson. Under you there. Radcliffe's brothers. Last seen hiking. Ooh. This map, they have the harem scarum. Harem scarum! Harem scarum! Okay. Freak show goes up in flames. I wonder what the, the 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 show has to do with you know like what what's what's it play a part in? I just have a feeling, like the show is going to be where the werewolves first started. Like we're gonna oh. go back into like the '30s when they showed up, and it turns out that like we're, we've been speaking to a ghost this whole time, uh -huh. like the lady, the fortune teller. This reminds me of Pretty Killer cray Frequency. Cray. Hello? Awkward. What do you mean they took everything from you, girl? Tell us more. Yeah, let's talk. What's up? <laughs> T. Hackett. Hmm. Hint. Not so much a hint as a slap in the face. July 7th, 1956. Fuck yeah. Wait, did you input that? No. Oh. Imagine the game listened to me. <laughs> What's it say? What did it say? Ooh. It's from Chris, and it's the podcast. It says, hey, T, you heard the shit. We got to shut it down. Can you handle it for me? Who's it from? Chris. Oh, sorry. Yeah, that's what you just said. Sorry, sorry, sorry. What's oh, a podcast? Weren't hikers at all, but ghost hunters who went in search of answers and fell victim to the mercy of the hag of Hackett's Quarry, never to be seen again. Like us. Except for the fell victim to the mercy of the blah, 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 blah part. We're, we're more like um, ghost investigators. Specter sleuths? Sure. 
So, Spectus, what happened next? Well, according to reports from the local paper, the North Kill Gazette, some hay bales caught fire during the opening night, and that spread pretty quickly. Before they knew it, the whole place was up in smoke, including the show's Bitch. leading lady and her alleged baby boy. <gasps> It's haunted. No, no, what is this? <gasps> Silas. This are yet bona fide. Okay. Is it bona fide or bona fide? Uh, I think it's all, it's like pecan, pecan, tomato, tomato. Bonafide. It's bonafide, not bonafide. Oh, am I hearing the crow because of the tarot card that we already found? Okay. I'm assuming. That was a good tip. See, those are tips we like. Awkward. Wait, pause. What did we just find out? So basically what we found out is that um, the the Bizarre Yet Bonafide podcast, Chris was knew about it. Okay. That, by the way, Ryan was listening to, so he could have been a narc. And, <laughs> um, and he could have told Chris. Chris uh, basically asked uh, his brother Travis okay. to take care of it. Okay, and, and he did. Well, and, he wrote up a letter. And he wrote up a letter. We do not know that it was sent. Um, but it was basically saying, don't look into this any further, or we will say that we're going to sue you. Yeah. And um, that's basically it. Uh, also, well, what we about found like out... The, like the, the story that they were telling? The Silas and stuff. Oh, so what... If I remember it correctly, and maybe if we go into the clues or evidence, it will tell us... Go to clues. Go down. Oh, wait, hold on. The previous sheriff was killed in the fire six years ago. So, yes, mm. that's why I was going. So, presumably, this belonged to him. Travis must have. Sorry. I didn't know what it Must have been trying to hide it. Mm -hmm. The fire of Harem Scaram six years ago took the lives of many, and it's rumored to have been arson. No wonder it made the front page. Okay, girl, we're getting the tea today. We don't have that yet. But we did get an achievement for getting the podcast. All right. Now let's go hide the needle and go to bed. Because she's like, I'm tired from having to, to scratch my eye out tonight. Yeah, that's a lot to handle today. Also, she had to do it on her own. Like, the guy wasn't around. There we go. Nice and cuddly, nice and cozy in there. And um, I'll see you later. <laughs> All right, bedtime. Are we just going to sleep? That, that's what it is. I mean, it'll progress the story. No, I know. I just I didn't know. Like, is that what she's planning to do? Like, yeah. to sleep? All right. Go to sleep. Go to sleep. Let me just cozy on up in here. Oh, girl. Why are we caressing? Okay, you want to tell me what happened? You want to tell me why I you got blood on you your face? Thing. Fair point. Fair point. Why didn't you run? <laughs> We've got unfinished business. I feel like determined. I don't know. Well, because like I won't leave Max. Max is kind of true. Like she still cares for him. Yeah. But she's he's already like on the fritz about her being being like not telling the truth. So yeah, maybe. I'm gonna say determined. All right. We've got unfinished business. Like what? 
like how you're gonna tell me exactly just what the fuck is really going on here. Why would I do that? Because I could be halfway home by now. But I'm not. Because I have to help Max. There you go, girl. Maybe I can help you too. Turn around, hands against the wall. Seriously? What? I am too tired to argue. But... Ugh. Me too. Mm. Oh, he would have found the syringe if we didn't put it away. Oh, Happy? yes. Or some coffee. All right. He respects us so he, we can find out more information. Uh, high five -y. High five -y. Yes. You guys are right. This one is a longer, a longer What's this? chapter. An education. Watch. Oh, he's got overalls now. Crazy Mac T, just finally join your Patreon on the highest. <gasps> yes! Thank you so much for being a Just Desserts tier. Thank you. And I also joined the Discord there, so we. So there we go. I'm caught up now. Yes! Oh, we're so happy to have you. Crazy Mac T, thank you so, so much. Nice you have no idea how much it means to us. Yeah, I. I mean. What are you drinking? It's harder than they make out in the textbooks. Especially when nobody's helping you. You're the doctor. Uh, animal doctor. And no, I'm not. And I probably never will be. Yeah. Stuck in here forever. You know. Because she knows too much now. Just because mm -hmm. you know. Doesn't mean you know. Oh, well, I mean, you that's know? fair. <laughs> you know? Uh what i'm not this isn't what it seems to be all right all right you're gonna have to be more specific yeah for real you and max are in just as much trouble as i am my family mm -hmm. we didn't mean to hurt anybody we're just trying to survive like everybody else. Do you understand? Not really. We're going to end this thing once and for all. The family or like you and Laura? We? Yeah, yeah. Be specific. Yeah. Curious, but that could push him over the edge. But she, she, I feel like in order for us to really like help everyone else out, we need to pry a little bit more. I think so. So curious. I think we should go curious. So how is your family involved? Yeah, yeah, yeah. My family. Mm hmm is down at the bottom of a well. Okay. okay. <gasps> wait, 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 what? In a hole in the bottom of the sea. Family is the most important thing in the world. Family. But if your whole family, you know, like every last one of them decided to jump down the bottom of a well and they're all just hanging on the end of a rope. How can one person be expected to pull them all back out? You can't. Wow, that's deep. If you pull on that rope, and you're just gonna fall right down to the bottom of the well with the rest of them. You use a pulley system. And what's the point of that? You just look at the camera. Oh, right, so girl, you, don't look at me. You're the one at the top of the well with the rope. <laughs> me trying to figure out shit. Yes, I thought that was obvious. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, I got it. <laughs> Christina. Okay, Edgar Allan Poe, Forget go it. off. Yes.
Let's see how smart you really are. What does that mean? Oh, maybe he's gonna turn to her for help. What is this? Information. Okay, okay. Let me see, let me see. Oh, what does it mean? <laughs> Read it. All right, let's do it. When full the moon above shines first, the beast internal yeah, yeah, where shall was? We got that. burst. One by one leads lambs to slaughter. It stalks your breath, but shuns clear water. Okay, okay. And should you yourself be cursed, armed with silver and the first, when moon is full before its wane, rend the beast that cursed you slain. No longer shall you face your blight <gasps> or fear the dread of full moon. They're light. trying to go after the, the big daddy werewolf. Yep. There's a big daddy werewolf? This Keep is like reading. Dracula. Like you kill Dracula and all the vampires. Oh, oh fuck. Oh, fuck. No, no, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. I'm sorry. Is it path updated? And if it's a bite with which you're faced cleave limb from torso with great which is haste. what he learned uh -huh. already perchance okay. you'll save your cursed soul before infection takes, takes its, its toll. toll starting to get the picture it's not a lot to go on what i think that's a lot we got it i think that's a lot frankly it's shit why did they have to make it <laughs> i don't know but it's all we have to go on. Maybe she, she finds him, us in deer. Kill the werewolf that bit you, and you'll be cured. It has to be silver. It has to be full moon. Mm. Seems pretty straightforward to me. If you can kill the werewolf, and that's a big if. I just want to cure Max. Is there a cure? It's not as straightforward as you think. I mean, both are good questions. Like, am I infected? Well, okay, so listen, this is my thinking process. If concerned, why am I infected? Maybe we can figure out, like, why, you know. Or it means we need to kill Max on the full moon. But it's like, why didn't you kill it? Will tell us, like, more about him, like, his intentions. I'm gonna go with confused. Okay. If you knew all this, why didn't you just kill it in the storm shelter when you had the chance? It's not so, I'm, I, I was, when I- Straightforward? No, yeah, it's so not, you... they're not so easy to hit. I was trying to protect you too. Mm. Mm. I don't believe him. He, that monster is, is, is his family or someone he knows. It's probably Chris. Yes, which because I think he said we know. his whole family is down the well. His whole family is infected because the because Chris's daughter was dead in the pool. Yeah, probably Laura killed her. But we want to, we haven't gone to that yet, so I think we should. Or we're, this guy seems like he has been on our side if we act nice. Yeah. So maybe we should be encouraging a little bit. I'm going this way. Okay. So what's the plan? Well, that's where I'm hoping you'll come in. Bitch. Me. <laughs> yeah. Cause your studies. Oh, he has no clue. I haven't even started. I mean, we still got a month away well, from you're the when best we have to like, I got. come and meet them. I've been hunting this damn white wolf under the full moon so long I start to think it doesn't exist, you know? White maybe it doesn't wolf. matter because maybe there's another way. Whatever you believe, there's got to be some science. And you do science. That's fair. Oh, I thought he was Look, crying for a second. Take some time to think about all this. I'll be back in the morning. Seen enough? I wonder if he heard everything that was going on. Probably. 
Um, cubby holes. What did I miss? Is everyone still alive? So far, everyone is still alive. Well, I mean, I guess technically because Nick's a werewolf now. Oh, yeah, but maybe I don't think I'd believe a word find you a just cure. said if I hadn't. If I hadn't seen that. What was he asked? Oh, he just said, I don't know that I would believe a thing if I hadn't just seen. I'm assuming he showed him the uh, picture of him. Videotape of him. Oh, videotape. Okay. Yeah. Um, I believe him. Let's go. I believe him. You can't tell me you really trust that guy now. I didn't say that. I said I believe him about the werewolf stuff, not the science bit. I don't know what he wants. He's a dirty line kidnapping cop, Laura. We should be careful of anything that fucker says. I think he. Well, <sighs> I'm blanking now. Fuck him. He's oh, had we a gotta fuck to him. That's what it is. We're getting out of here and we're gonna fix it all. Jacob our own. Young, Sergio, if you see this, who should I play as killer in TCM? Oh, I, I personally Lord. love Sissy, but we haven't yeah. leveled her up yet. So I think Cody would say I Johnny. Saw what happened. Yeah, we've been doing Johnny. We've been doing what Johnny. What I did see you We've been doing Johnny. Yeah. Is it bad? Yeah, it's pretty bad. I'm so sorry. Oh. Maybe empathetic to make him feel better? Yeah, probably. It wasn't you. I know it wasn't you. Oh, I know. Sweetie, it's okay. Well, no, but it's it was not okay, but we're going to fix you, Max. Promise. I promise. You said let me in there. Uh-oh. 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 Uh -oh. It's a scream, baby. Oh. Oh, hold on. Before you mess it. Super chat, last year R. Thank you so much for the super chat. What did you guys think of Billy's design in Saw 4? Um, I I think he was just as creepy. Yeah. I do like the little doll of of him that they got this discovered. No spoilers, of course. But um, yeah, I think I liked it. I agree. He did look huge though. Said you scrapped an abandoned car. A while back, I, I worked out the rest. Deputy Dewey. Shit. Why? Well, why'd Why? you think, Chris? Jesus, Travis. You're still here? That's fucked up. Fucking bit one of them, Chris. I'm not supposed to. You fucking <gasps> bit one of knew them. It, knew it, knew it. No! My God, babe, you needed to be on top of it. Okay, you're. Just I, well, okay, so it, uh, it doesn't tell me what direction to go until. Oh, did I have you an energy drink? Me. Did you bring up an energy drink? No. Nope. Like oh no, yeah, I forgot. So... Sorry, I didn't choose an energy drink. What's your plan? You can't keep them here forever. I'm handling it. Maybe if you'd done your job, they wouldn't have been at the camp that night. You ever think of that? Oh shit! Do it. You are reading. Done job, you'd all be in prison. You ever think of that? That was all Bobby and Caleb. Are you those know hikers? It. That that. Journalist? Damn it, Travis. What are we going to do now? Whatever happened to we're all in this together? We're all, all in this together. I forgot the lyrics. Crazy back to you. Oh, my God. I just got wet. David or Kev. Oh, my God. Yes. Agreed. A lot of wetness going on. Max. Uh. Max. Uh. What is it? Travis was just in the hall talking. The cop. So? With Chris Hackett. Was he here to let us out? No. Sadly. He's the werewolf, Max. Chris Hackett 
is the one that bit you down on the storm shelter. Do you think he's the big bad? Holy shit. He might be the big bad. No, there can't be a big bad. Who would have guessed? A person that is a big bad. I feel like a werewolf that is pure. I mean, I guess werewolf. thinking about it, I could have. And yet you didn't. It all makes sense. That's why Chris's car was at the lodge that night. Travis was protecting him. That's why he followed us, mm -hmm. and that's why he didn't kill the werewolf in the storm shelter because it yeah. was his fucking she got there brother. Eventually. God, it's so obvious. We didn't need to choose that if, for you, if girl. If Chris was the one that bit me, then. Yeah, then that's our cure. <gasps> that's our big bad. That's how we fix you. Jesus, Laura, are we thinking the same thing? Escape time. Tomorrow we're getting out of here. Oh fuck. I'm gonna get Travis's gun and kill Chris Hackett. Okay, girl. All right. Hey! Oh hey. god. Okay, hold on. Before we enter this next round round, I know I have a feeling we need to keep him alive. Yes. We need to keep Max alive. Yes. And I also I'm just thinking. Think? So, what if the, like, what if Silas, the baby... Wait, wouldn't it be, like, so fucked up right now to be like, we're going on break, guys! Bye! <laughs> yeah, we're calling that a night. No, no, no. Um, I'm ready. What if Chris was bit by Silas, the little brother, like, the, the baby boy yeah. from the harem scarum yeah. thing because there's it's supposed to be like a freak show right so they could have they could have had the the werewolf like in a cell so people could come see the transformation and be like oh, oh fuck yeah and then there was a fire and it got out and the the hag of hackett's quarry the ghost is the mom trying to fucking warn people <gasps> it's all coming together guys it's i think it's coming together okay Le 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 travis it's your cell she just sits down, spreads her legs. Come here, daddy. Oh, no, girl. <laughs> Although, for some reason, I can't say Lear. It sounds weird. Lore. Lear? Lore. The more you say Lear. Lore. 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 L like Laura. No, but because lore. that's not how you said it before. Lore. Lore. Lore? So it's Lore. Yeah, Lore, Travis, and your shell. L okay, Lore. Lure. 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 Lure See, Lure. But so you're saying Lore or Lure? It's. It, it's or Lure. Potato, potato. Anyways, let's go. Let's go. Let's try it. Okay, hold on. Let's <laughs> let's me. say let's say we're gonna continue this game, and we're going to kill it, and we're going to slay, mm -hmm. and we're going to yes, mama down the house boots. <laughs> Amen. Okay. All right. Help her. Lord needs help. Uh, Laura? What the fuck was that noise? Laura, are you okay? Oh fuck, I'm gonna have to be quick. God quick fingered. Okay, we got this, we got this, we got this. Fuck you, fuck you. Come on. Oh, yeah, it hurts. What the hell's going on? Laura? Show me what I have to do. Okay. Okay. Oh. Fuck. How are you feeling, girl? You feeling good? Sorry about it. Oh, wow. That's that's fast. Path chosen. So we had a path to not do that. I didn't think you were really sick. Well, maybe I should consider acting as my major. <laughs> I wouldn't go that far. All right, guys, not the time. We need to get the fuck out. We need to get the fuck out. We should go before he wakes yeah. up. I know. Dead body. Dead body. Sorry, dude. But he should be fine, right? He's not gonna turn right there. He's gonna turn in a month. Yes. We should grab our stuff. <laughs> They're just we need staring, some ammo. staring into he must the have abyss. Some around here.
What the fuck what is, is that? I thought I heard someone. That's the hag. That's the hag. Oh, hag. It sounds like a fortune teller. It does it's sound like a fortune teller. Maybe we need to follow the noise. I think we should. All right. Use that werewolf strength. Or the no, keys. the keys. <laughs> what? <laughs> Christina, <laughs> Sergio, you called for me. <laughs> oh damn! What, 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 what is this? What is it? It's, oh, a it's a gun. It's a go gun. Bag. Okay, cool, 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 cool. Okay. Also, don't what these the bags fuck? look familiar? Like maybe oh, the ones that were from the from the. Oh I my god! Some. They were from what is uh, when we were with Emma. Shotgun shells. He loads them with silver. That's where he was last month hunting. Well, I guess I won't be needing this anymore. Hey, I just realized something. We're free. <laughs> I feel like we should be reassuring right now. I feel like we're pretty... Mm, I don't feel like she would say, hell yeah, we are. But like, you know... I feel like she was also determined to be like, not until Chris is dead, right. motherfucker. But but I don't feel like she should be anxious. Yeah. But it also should be like, we're keeping ourselves on our toes. I don't know. I say reassuring. Okay. Hell yeah, we are. Oh, yes. That's two months we'll never get back. But for now, we're one step closer to going home. And when is that? Tonight. We're going to Hackett's quarry. And we're killing Chris Hackett. Wait, but I forgot what the date was, so maybe it's tonight. What if Ryan is Silas? No way. That doesn't know. make sense. I'm throwing shit at walls. That make that doesn't make sense. Throwing but he is the most well informed about this, so. Even though we only did one thing in that thing, it still and was I scary. I made my way here. Making my way to F camp. Max at the island seemed like the best place for him, surrounded by water and all. Which somebody did say That's in the chat, it. please do not That's spoil. We really would appreciate figuring this game out on our own. And I'll Thank jump you, in at everybody. the same yes. time. But little tips like, oh, you forgot that little like yeah, card wait. over there. We like the island, like like our island, like the one in the lake. Yeah, why? Because Jacob, he went back there looking for Emma and he hasn't come back yet. Neither of them has. Oh shit. I forgot a question. <laughs> well, he just realized that Emma and Jacob were on the island. Okay. Does she know? <laughs> They're I mean, not it there says now. Honest. And then they're probably fine. I don't know. I think she should be worried a little bit. So this one? Though. I don't know. I think honest. Well, if they were there, they're not there now. What's that supposed to mean? Don't make me spell it out for you. I've just come back from there and there's one werewolf and no people. Oh, fuck. They, they All I know worried, is right? I have to do this. I have to kill Chris Hackett before it's too late. <laughs> and Chris probably locks himself down in the sex dungeon. That's why, like, the sex after you dungeon. saw me at the pool, after I shot Chris, um, I went back to the island expecting Max to be back to normal. <gasps> what? He's not the big bad. He's not the big bad. Wait, so they, she shot Chris? She didn't shoot Chris. She shot Kaylee. Oh, okay, okay. I thought she just meant that it didn't work. I mean, how do you tell? I 
mean, where is Max? Max should be turned by now, right? Unless she kept Max somewhere. Besides the hor horrific things that are happening tonight, it's glorious outside. Look at this, this is beautiful. Like, only thing lighting your path Max? is the moon. What's up? What's up, people? We push Max off the edge. We killed Max. Max. Oh no. Don't tell me. Max? Because we locked Hello? him up in there. Oh no. Oh. Oh no, we're gonna have to decide right now. Oh shit! Oh my god. Oh no, maybe he's okay. Oh no. No. Oh no, our werewolves woke up! So the werewolf I killed can't have been Chris. That wasn't a werewolf. It was Haley Hackett, Chris's daughter. Whatever I shot, that was no girl. Unless, I, I guess, He's a defensive. it turned back after I shot it when I went to the island. Wait, so <laughs> how come Perfect Max wants those treats from his last stream. <gasps> what? Oh, wait, 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 no. wait, 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 show bite or hide bite what we did got, he say he said so how come max didn't kill you then and we got bit when did that happen apparently when we were falling welcome to my nightmare. oh welcome dorian jones you've come in at a scary moment because even if we said hide bite we still got bit i feel like we gotta have the cards on the table but they might attack me if we do cards on the table but does it mean that he'll she'll turn now she might turn sometime tonight. Show bite. Let's take a chance. All right. He tried. I got away. I need to end this. Yeah. They were going to do that. I knew it. I knew it. Tall Ice Drink Show. Better to be honest. Time. Yeah. We try to be honest. What's going on? Who is this? This is Mama. Mama? <gasps> Wait! Oh. Wait! The Queen! Yes! Bitch! Oh! So uh. this is our new game. Bourbon is mad. Bourbon senses evil. Go on. Take a bow. Lin Shay, Don't everybody. Everybody. Lin Shay. Wait, this is seven. And Travis earlier said he can think of seven reasons why. There must be seven werewolves. Oh, seven, uh, girl. God, let me go! Let me fucking go! Get your hands off me! Okay, we got some daddy and daddy action going on right now. Threatening. Please let me go. <laughs> please let me last go! Time, hey, where's last time? Hey, where's last time? It was good. Happen, oh. Please! Please! Oh my god, why aren't you answering me? Oh, 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 is your, is your money that you want? Cause, cause my dad's got money. And lots of it. Are you, I mean, not really, of course but his dad you can get some, money. probably. His dad's got money. Please, <laughs> just let me go, please. I'm so sorry. 
For what? Oh, I guess. Oh, Jesus Christ! I hope they don't trap us in here with one. There's a cage within a cage. Ooh. Things are getting uh, That's spicy. Too, <laughs> Who's the second? Nick. Hey. Maybe. Did they catch Nick? Hey. Hey, where are you going? Hey. Hey. Girl, up. There's a there's a werewolf. Were demon. I'm gonna call this thing a were demon. Oh shit. The song choice. We're in the fucking basement. We're in the sex dungeon. Sex dungeon. Sex dun. <gasps> okay, so this bitch doesn't really Nosy do anything. Nosy little rat, aren't you? Poking oh. your nose where it doesn't belong. Don't believe everything you hear. Okay, we get it, girl. Like, don't come anyway, at us. Here we are again. Let's see what you've brought me this time, shall we? Okay. We got the chariots. We got the chariot. The job, us. At the reins of a chariot, we would all dun, dun, feel dun, 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 dun. Taking control, relying Lying on control. determination to make our choices. Valiant, but in some cases, foolish. I know. Many seek refuge in chariots. But perhaps in some cases, they're not as safe as we think they are. Ah, the world. <laughs> Often travelers' paths are direct, but sometimes it is not so simple. Okay. Sometimes they're intertwined with others. Compassion over anger. You will need friends where you're going. It's not until we fall into the belly of the beast that we realize how perilous things can be. And the same question as always. Will you let me <laughs> and show once you again, more? tell me what you want. I'm literally on my last limb right now. All right, which one do we want to see? Chariot or world? Only one future can be seen. Choose. Oh, shit. Okay, describe them really quickly. Okay, so this was like, like, you can make your choices. And like, you can be really determined, but sometimes that being determined and your instinct isn't actually what it seems to be. Yeah. This one seems like you need a group of friends and befriend people in order to conquer something. Sometimes you can't do it alone. Yeah. Much, much rather what I want to say. I mean, I kind of like at this point, I kind of want to see who our allies are, right? All right. You'll be seeing me a few more times before the night's over. I look forward to that, as long as you follow the right path, of course. We'll try, girl. We'll try. What's that? We completed, completed chapter, chapter seven. seven. All right, let's chapter check eight. in. Are we gonna go through another chapter? All right, here's the, here's the deal, guys. Hey, Chance, welcome back. Oh, snaps, we still alive? Yeah, we are. Mm -hmm. We're kind of really determined. We've had our ups and downs this stream. <laughs> but chat, we're going to put it into your hands. Oh, we're like the little like mystic beings. So oh, let me girl, see. Oh, you know <clears throat> chat's going to say yes. Well, hold on. Let me see. Well, you've come to see me again. All right. Well, what do you choose? Do we stream with another chapter? 
or do we call it a night? The decision is up to you whether their great outcomes is up in the air. Girl, literally everyone is saying yes. What do you choose? Wait, I gotta give her like deadpan boil. <laughs> it's only 5 p.m. for me, please. One more, call it another chapter. Yes. Frank says sleep is for the week, but I'm weak. Um, I okay, agree with I Chance. Mean, I, Wait, what did Chance say? I, I missed what Chance said. One more chapter. Go right, for let's, it. Let's another do one. Another chapter, but another one. I need to take a super quick break. Oh, I need I need a pee break for sure. So um, and c bourbon is like literally like oh do you want should we take bourbon out? Girl, it's, that could be like thirty minutes. Well, we don't know how long the next chapter is. We'll figure that out. All right. So you guys, oh, so you guys have chosen, and we're going to play another chapter. But we'll be going on a break because our bladders. Well, can't we hold will it. be going on a break. The stream will be taking a pause. Not us two, but yes, we are going to take a little pause. So here we go. We will meet you back in two minutes with another chapter.
all the dancing I'm gonna do. Oh, did we get Bourbon Street? <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> well, I just loved it so much. do not want it oh he didn't want it he didn't want the treat all right well i don't think we have another one over here unfortunately sorry all right welcome back guys we are going to be doing one more chapter we did happen to look up how many chapters there are we should probably be organized that way uh but we did not promise organization on this channel um so what we're doing is there's 10 chapters in the quarry uh, not, you know, maybe like considering time of whatever happens, right? Or uh -huh. if we need to like possibly redo things. Um, but there's 10 chapters. So we're going to do chapter eight right now. Um, and then we're going to end it there. And then we're going to do the final two for the grand finale of The Quarry, which is going to be next weekend. All right. Accident out. Okay. We're back in it. And this is gonna be full of you. All right. You're you're ready to so, go back in? A Cody live stream. Just go ahead. Okay, this is up. a Cody and Sergio live stream that <laughs> you're just the one playing okay. for today. I'm gonna cut oh no, maybe I'm no. Okay, let's go. Uh and for those who may be concerned about our dog, I'm just gonna get a little closer to the keyboard. Um our dog he's... turned into a werewolf yep. and now um he's wrecking havoc. Yeah, we are actually both ghosts right now. He already killed us, so Right. Don't worry, he'll be back over there. And probably he'll be back over minutes. there, yeah. <laughs> All righty, let's go. Uh, oh, but we got a shout out to Skull Killers. Skull Killers, we love you. Gonna meet the stream so I can watch my third favorite movie, Saw 4, but second time with your, reac your reactions. Oh my God, yes. Yay, have fun. Guys, please, if you could, go show some love to the Saw 4 reaction. We had such a great time with that. Uh, with them. Well, I don't know about Cody, but like... <laughs> It was it was a time. So go over to Saw 4, check it out, press that like button. Let's continue with yeah. the quarry. Well, and just a friendly reminder before we get started again, if you would like to have us just in your ears and on your screens while you're watching Saw 4 or any of the other movies that we've covered recently, we have watch alongs on our Patreon. So you can go join Patreon to get those watch alongs. <laughs> big big head old freak. At least you died playing the quarry. That's true. True. That's what's gonna say on our tombstone. <laughs> The belly of the beast. Where is his hat? Oh, shit. Hold on. Sorry. Also, Reyna, do you guys think Devin Sawa is hotter with or without a beard? I don't know why we got picked. I like him with a... Mm, that's... It's weird. Because with a beard, I think he's, he's sexy as fuck. But with, without a beard, I just want to, like, hold him. I just want to touch his, like... <laughs> I want to touch his head. Anyways, let's go back. Bye. Guys, she murdered Kaylee. We have been over this. I said shut up. Caitlin, what do I do? What? You're going to put it on Caitlin? I mean, we can't kill her. She knows so much information. What if Laura was the big bad all this time? No, I'm kidding. I don't know. Make it uncertain. Well, if we do uncertain and Caitlyn's like, shoot her, then he's gonna shoot her. True. Like. All right, let's give him some top energy. Top energy. I said, shut up. You've done enough talking. Okay, so you talk. Say what you gotta say. You say what you need to say. To say that. I mean, just think about everything that's happened tonight. The body in the lake too. Remember what Jacob said? Yeah, right. Listen to me. These people are not Ooh, who you is. think they are, I promise. What do you mean? I'm curious, you said you heard a woman? I'm curious. Hold up. You, you said you heard a woman crying when you escaped? Why? What do you know? <laughs> not the slurping. It's the ghost story <laughs> you told us about. Right? I'm sorry. <laughs> This isn't a ghost story. It's a creature feature. It's really happening, and you're all in it. It's a creature feature, bitch. Your bracelet. Oh. 
What are you doing? Oh. I'll shoot you. No, we're not doing that. It's just wages. What are you doing? I'm trying to help. Worst case scenario, this should give you a fighting chance. And this will kill them? For good? Yeah. But what if it's Nick or someone? Like I said, worst case scenario. Guys, the performances in this are really Frank, good. Put that fucking thing down before you hurt someone. Zara, Zeri, just started to watch your channel, the reaction to horror, and I love you guys already sub to your channel. Thank you so much. Thank you. Zeri. So, come on. Where does Chris Hackett live? When he's not at camp, I mean. What makes you think I know? <laughs> I wouldn't tell you. <laughs> mean. I'm doing guarded. What makes you think I know that? Uh, I you guys are counselors, right? You've spent the last two months here? He's not in the storm shelter. I'm clearly getting nowhere hunting him in the woods. I need a place to start. Guys, let's cooperate with I her. think that spooky house behind these woods. That Dude. is a spooky house. What? Have you thought about not killing him? Maybe there's another way. Uh, both are kind of asking the same questions a little bit. So should he be sarcastic or compassionate? Depending on how we know Laura. Let's do compassionate. Listen, there could be another way. Have you thought about that? I've spent the last month thinking about nothing else. Shinar says, I'm uncomfortable Look, with the when werewolf. When the sun comes up, I am stuck <laughs> until the next full moon. So is Max, so is anyone else he's bitten. How is that our problem? Why don't you ask your friends in the woods? And don't forget about Nick, dude. Okay, any clothes are gonna have to spray you two with cold water. Ryan, let's just get out of here. I'm running out of time. If I can't find Chris Hackett, then a lot more people are going to get hurt. Yes. Believe her, dude. Come on. So I'm curious, I'm like, what? what did all the campers do uh, the one yeah, full month in the middle said. of the summer? Oh, yeah, that's true. Did they go away, like, on a different quarry? Chris has nothing to do with this. No way you're going alone. Ooh. 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 Oh, remember the vision. Remember the vision? What happened in the vision? He was with her and he fell down. So that means that could know his fate. But maybe it'll lead us to someplace underground and we'll find his lair. No way you're going alone. You think we should do this? I think so. Okay. There's I'm no way you. I'm letting a murdering fugitive like you go anywhere near Chris on your own. Wow, are you flirting with me? Oh, oh. no. Oh, girl. Fine. I do like whatever her. you want. I love Laura, actually. You saw what happened to She's me. She's definitely giving She's Sarah Connor vibes. I didn't I'm think I liked it. her at the beginning, but now I do. Everything's going to be fine. That cop car you stole, where is it? Ditched in the lake. Why? It was a stolen cop car. You're going to have to try and fix the minivan. Get somewhere safe. I don't know if he can. How long do you have? He also has one hand. An hour or two? I don't know. It doesn't seem like an exact science. Then we better get going. All right. Here we go, guys. All right. So we got the confirmed werewolf. Uh, in training versus the suspected werewolf. Are you sure this is the right way? Big Daddy. Pretty sure. Yeah. Hi, Papa. Pretty or definitely? Papa, it's okay. People like you. What do I stream. look like? A tour guide? People love you. Oh, uh oh, we're splitting up. More. This doesn't feel right. Have you been here? <gasps> Have you actually been there before? I mean, n no. Wait, seriously? I know as much as you do. Mm. Mm, 
sure you do. How well do you know Chris Hackett? Mr. H, pretty well. Like you're pretty sure we're going the right way? When I first came to camp, I was going through some personal shit, and Mr. H helped me sort it out. He's a good guy. You don't know him like I do. You don't know him at all. Okay, okay, jeez. Teacher's pet. <laughs> Why are you like this? I should ask you the same thing. Uh... I should ask you the same thing. What do you mean? Hayden, I feel like really this here? chapter is going to be our welcome to I can't let you just moment. shoot him. I'm not going I would to. Live. I'm okay. going Honestly, to that shoot was so a werewolf, iconic. which he definitely is, by is the way. not. Is too. It's not. Oh, Jesus. He's getting more suspicious as time goes on. Also, those headphones are definitely not working anymore. They're mad wet right now. It's okay, because if I'm right, he doesn't even need to there listen to find out what happened to Corey, because he is in the middle of it. Yeah. Oh, this is looking so pretty So he lives abandoned. in some redneck spooky. mansion with spooky. his redneck family in the ass crack of the woods? Look at this place. No, but it's where his mom lives, I think. Never been there, but if we're Mama? looking for answers, it's probably the best place to start. Manny Noir, I wish I was watching the so, game with you all, uh, but I don't wait, want to spoil it for myself there? and miss the previous parts. What do you Love mean? you both. Oh, Aww. it's okay, but thank you so much for How saying hi. do we get to the house? That's a really also, Bourbon good better question. not know dark over our camera. Oh my god, right? Is he like close to it? Yes. Oh, Maybe god. we just don't. Who side are you on? I get it. He's your friend. Look, I understand Chris is your friend. If there was another way, I'd tell you. Oh, sure. I, I'm, I'm hearing some yeah. crackling and crackling. Laura. Chris is a good man. This yeah. isn't about good and evil, Ryan. Just how can you be so certain? If I let my conscience slow me down now, everything gets a lot worse for everyone. Believe me, if there's another way, I'm all for it. So Where spooky. are you going? You're on the timer. Oh, remember? it's happening here. There must be another way across somewhere. I got you. Careful, it's gonna go. <laughs> They both oh. fell. I thought only one happened here. Oh no. Well, maybe if oh, they were angry, shit. he would have been running away from her. Are you okay? And oh, only he would have fallen. Laura? Oh, because of the water. Uh huh. It stalks your breath, but shuns clear water. Why didn't she just. Cut her, oh my her god, Laura. <sighs> it's healed. Jesus, Mary and Jazz Hands. Jesus, Mary, Mary and Jazz, Jazz hands. hands. Oh, Lord. Here's a thought. What are you doing? Relax. Look. Oh, her oh. eye's good. <gasps> yeah. And her eye color is different. Hope you guys, you uh -huh. have grandma. No if shit. She was, if she was angry. Then he would have gone away. Can you see yellow in my eyes? Like he would have been separated from her. Define yellow. Shit. We haven't got much time. It's, it's okay. No use looking back. Let's keep going. All right. Oh, and we're her. <laughs> time to explore everything. Make sure for the look out for those tarot cards. Yep. Hi, Bubba. People can only see your tail wag. Okay. I hope you have fun with that toy. This must be part of the old working quarry. Makes sense. Tight bastards just can't pay us. All right. The forgotten belongings of a quarry miner abandoned in tunnels. A letter of look foreclosure which indicates that this has been down here since the 1930s damn girl all right so let's see i want to look at that again so we can read the letter yeah all righty show text 
Dear valued employee, I regret to inform you that your services at Hackett's Quarry will no longer be required. Oh, shit. It is my intention to return the site of the central quarry to an area of natural beauty by flooding it and allowing a lake to form in its place. You'll be paid until the end of this coming week and then asked to vacate the premises. Damn. I'd like to thank you for your continued loyalty and wish you well in all your future endeavors. Yours faithfully, Septimus Hackett. And then somebody had handwritten, Septimus. tight bastard can't, just can't pay us. And the last time I trust a Hackett. Listen, we also did not want to trust a Hackett. All right, let's do this. So what that makes me wonder is if this was flooded in the 30s, what if they were werewolves back then? Oh, shit. And that was like the family coming up with the way, just like what she did with Max, where like they can have somewhere to hide that's surrounded by water and they can't get you out. See that already? Oh. Until like they're done turning. Oh, no. These must have been from the quarry days. No, duh. Wow. He's, he's bitter. All right, let's see. Old camp photo. Ooh, 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 ooh. Austin works. I'm going to go to bed. Good night, y'all. Good night, Austin. Thank you so much for joining us as usual. We'll see you next week when we conclude the Hackett. Mm -hmm. No, the quarry. That's what it's called, the Hackett. <laughs> Laura, oh, wait, both of those? These yeah, keys so belong to the North Kill Police Department. Where are they? Why, why are they out here in the island? Wait, I want to read. Can you just let me Sorry. read? Laura stole the police car to escape and ditched it in the lake. She must have left the keys on the island along with Max. Okay, I'm done. And this was the photo that I thought kind of looked like this might be Ryan. It is, in fact, young Chris Chacket and, and Travis. It says Chacket and Thacket. Chacket and Thacket. That's, I don't like it. And they were little bu babies. Bubs? I was going <laughs> to say Bubba's, little Bubba's. But we call our dog Bubba's. Mm -hmm. Right now, damn, Sergio gets angry fast. I only get uh, peeved if Cody does not wait up for me. What? Well, because I said I want to read it. Oh. Yeah. All right, so would you like to read this? Laura and Max were kidnapped by Travis and Chris tied to hide it, but not try to hide it, to hide it, but not recording. Report, I can't read. Reporting that they didn't even show up for camp. Ugh. Ooh, more. Makes total sense, knowing he was on a time limit. Chris didn't want to risk the nurse being around when he turned into a werewolf. Mm -hmm. <sighs> okay. Oh, no. Okay, Someone's ladies, now we got years. information. <gasps> I don't uh, like it. I don't like it. This could be where, like, all the monsters are. We gotta be extra careful. Well, remember also, if he if she had not fallen down with him, she's the one who had the gun, so he would have been down here with no weapons. Oh, true. I think we made the right call. I think we did too. What was that? Oh, just steps. Sorry. Yeah. Scared the crap out of me. Come on. Do you not want to walk this way? Walk, walk this, this way. way. Thank you. All right, let's go back this way. Make sure that there's no no little tarot card anywhere. Oh, tarot! You said tarot card too. I know. So I'm I'm doing it lovingly for you. No, you're not. You Is said it out out of instinct. No, I say it as a joke. Bourbon, everyone, wish Bourbon to go sleep on his bed. Bourbon, the weird dog, is contemplating the bed. <laughs> Did you hear that too? It's her. It's hag. Oh. <gasps> That's Lynn Shane. That's hag. definitely Lynn Yeah, it's the hag. It's like she's warning us off. Or guiding us. Or guiding us. I don't know. Last time she it, she looked like she was like fucking with it. And she was just oh, shit. Oh, that will have made a lot of noise. Yeah. No, they can't have done. This place is not up to code. I mean, if the that's code your, is literally that, crumbling to say. the ground, then I think it's doing fine. Let's just keep moving. Yeah. Careful. Jeez. All right. 
Should we go this way? Ooh, I bet we can't. We cannot. Okay. Wow. Which was like the last of us where we just like jump. Yeah. Sergio must have been into 2000s punk rock bands since he gave a soundstream performance of <gasps> the credit song. This is all for. Yes! Oh my god, thank you so much. And yes, My Chemical Romance, I don't I don't know if you consider them punk rock. I always thought they were like emo Just look rock. At this place. But My Chemical Romance was my shit. I went to go see them in concert when I was like 15. There's a lot of rust. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> Alright, now kiss. Oh, no, not the time. Back here, I could really do with a hamburger right about now. Stop being weird. I wish you could see him, but he's trying to fit through the chairs. Yeah. What, Ferb? You can't do it. I wish you could see him, but he's uh, he's right here. Uh, all right, let's go. Shan, hey guys, big fan of yours. My seven-month-old daughter loves you. Oh, Aww. oh my God, we're gonna. We're filthy. <laughs> but thank you so much, Shan. Oh boy, this is high. Whoa. <gasps> oh no. Do you think dark flesh? A lump of what appears to be damaged on or scarred flesh. Truly something is in here with us. Either that, or this route isn't as disused as we thought. Oh, Christina says, not gonna lie, my son turned six months in 10 days, and he always smiles when he hears you guys. Oh my god. So, so sweet. sweet. Thank you. That literally, hearing that stuff pours my heart. Down. Cause who knew silly, like, silly us would appeal to people? <laughs> Well, oh. where's Cave out? <laughs> Look who's finding their funny bone. They are flirting, like, mad hard, like, mm -hmm. chill. Tall Asian chick, Laura being messy by flirting with Ryan while still, she's still with Max. Like, we're still trying to save Max here. So what's your deal, then? What do you mean? I am horrifying. I bet you the want some meat, all right? The mysterious brooding loner thing it doesn't quite fit with the <laughs> I love That's my camp leader vibe. <laughs> So I don't fit into the right box. Is that what you're saying? What? What do you mean box? Wait, patient. You know what? That's not what I patient? meant. I think we should be patient. That's not your eye color right now, ma'am. You know, that's not what I mean. I've been coming here for years. You get to know a place and it feels like a second home. You know, I mean, until now. <laughs> Burbitt's not what even on the camera. Your yep. friend, Just like uh, his leg. Caitlin, is that her name? It seems like she looks up to you. I guess uh, I'm, I'm kind of closer to Dylan, though. Yeah. After oh. tonight, I don't know. Oh. Trauma can bring people together. That's that's yeah. fair. It works on The Bachelor. So yep. what about you? Who do you like more? I don't know. We do. Maybe neither. <gasps> oh, that's fine. I mean, he's not into it. He's not into it. We gotta respect that. This way. I see a light. Yeah. This is sketchy. Or you can just hang out here. Up to you. <gasps> oh, God. Is he gonna choose? What the hell? Thanks for your help. You had it under control. He's giving a sexual. Yeah, oh, that's what I thought. I thought too. Ooh. Welcome, Jam Jameson boy. Oi. We, oh, we didn't read either one. Okay. Oh wait, hold on. Oh, hold on. My voice. The lovers. Oh, the wheel of fortune. The wheel, wheel of fortune. Yay! Woo! <laughs> <laughs> 
the wheel of fortune after all fortune is nothing but a spinning wheel sometimes you just have to take a chance karma works in mysterious ways but it all favors those who pay attention watch closely though the wheel spins the eagle-eyed can't tell where it's going to stop next the lovers Ooh. oh shit the lovers there's harmony in this agreement brought to light only by sparks of passion blood flows from the heart you can almost taste it and tasting it could save someone's life interesting life, life. this does look like them both though mm -hmm. what is what are they trying to say what if he needs, like, to save her and keep her from going to being a werewolf? He needs, like, give her a little blood. Oh, no. He needs to, like, come. And then... Oh. Um... Looks promising. I gotta get out of here. I gotta get out of here! All right. No, it's not done. Excuse you. I feel like we only get, like, two max cards. Yeah, but there might be more clues. Oh, good. He came back for me. Sonara, he needs some milk. Oh, my God. Yes. Uh, Crazy MacT, check out the kitty cam and Discord, Discord in the gaming section. Since you have a doggy cam. Oh, Thanks. I got to go Fine. check it out. Guess we found the party. Alcohol and prohibition. That could come in handy. These are running shit up. panels. That would make that liquor almost a hundred years old. Oh, probably still good. Good. Try vintage. <laughs> All right, maybe oh, they're the kind of cute to together. I don't that know. Makes sense. I guess when the cores are done, they branched out. Come on, time travel later. We didn't even get into the spooky house yet. Nope. Like we're still outside. Or maybe we're like, maybe this is the beginning of the inside. I think it is. You think this is it? Oh, God. Uh, Let's get you out of oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm pretty much completely lost. <sighs> yeah, me too. Shall we? We shall. Let's go. Caitlin. Is it almost like morning? That's what it looks like. Yeah. Oh, so while they, they're going to the spooky house and they're going downstairs, I'm nervous because this group has a lot of people that we don't know. Mm -hmm. So we have to choose wisely. Oh my god, I just saw your uh, cat post crazy mech tea. What the hell happened? Oh so god, adorable. So cute. We have to keep moving. That's my bad. We have to keep moving. <gasps> or why? What's your thinking of I don't know. What did he say? Honestly, I didn't even hear. <laughs> um What's the goal? Get the mini we have working. Okay. Well, we need Jacob. What did he, uh, Maybe keeping it nice and slow is easy best. I don't know. I, I, I trust you. I say we have to keep moving. Okay. Nothing good. We've got to keep moving. It's not safe here. Mr. H is going to be pissed. Look, honestly, if half of what Laura's saying is true, I really don't care what Mr. H thinks. It's true. What do you think happened to Jacob and Emma? Probably nothing. Hopefully. I mean, I mean, should we go find them? Warn them? I think the safest thing, the most responsible thing, is to try and get help. Right. That's and then fair. we can come back for them. And Nick. And Nick. <laughs> They're both like, no, I think Nick is a goner. Well, we know at least that Emma got back here. Yeah, Emma's here, so I don't know at what point. But Jacob she gets has it. the Wait. thing to get it working. What? No, he doesn't. 
I thought he lost it. No, he went down and got it. Okay. Remember? Is he there... went down and got it for you. But where does there something he... in there? Because he only has a box. I don't know. Or. Oh. <gasps> what is it? Oh, Emma's in there. Oh, Emma's in there. Jacob? Don't Emma? shoot. If it says shoot, don't shoot. Are they... Should I open it up? Your funeral, buddy. Probably oh. stings. Yeah. It's all I could find in the van. I like that the the game like takes uh, little breaks. Dylan, <laughs> you're oh. uh. Oh, the hand. Um, I like that it takes little breaks. Like it's like now a commercial break. Mm -hmm. So she was in the police station this whole time? Insane, right? This whole time, we were having such a fun summer. We never knew. Jeez. Okay. Can you fix it? No. Oh. Well, not without some parts. Specifically, a rotor arm. There's a scrapyard up the road. So you can fix it? Well, no promises, but if there's hope, that's where we're going to find it. Sounds like a long shot. Oh God, I need you. I need you. I think so. Dylan, come on. I need you. We need you. Yeah. Fine. Okay. Once again, Dylan puts himself in mortal danger for the sake of his work friends. Oh God. He's definitely giving us What like, exactly are we supposed to do? I mean, the van is nice, that. but oh, it's no. not exactly Fort Knox. Well. There's a shelter under the lodge. He's you could definitely be safe giving there like, for a while. I'll be right there. Right. Abby, Bye. you're with me. Good luck. Okay, so Abby is with Emma, which is good mm -hmm. because Emma's a badass. But they're going to the shelter beneath the lodge, which is bad because there's a werewolf there. <sighs> and they're going up just like up the road. Yep. But she's got the, the gun, so that's good. I wish they kind of planned that like, okay, what are, what's our weapons? Like, what can we use? I'm cold all of a sudden. Our AC kicked on. <laughs> well, that's why we're comfy. It's fall vibe right now. Even though this one is going to be the hottest where we are. I'm horrifying. He said he is not getting paid enough for this, and he meant it. Yeah. He's not backing down. Oh. What was that? <gasps> huh? What was oh, that? Oh, it's nothing. We got, we got guests downstairs. We don't want any more blood on our hands. Oh. Oh, her eyes are fine. Interesting. Yeah. Oh, this is where we can get um, Jacob. This way. Yes. But we don't have the keys. Correct. Just making sure I didn't miss anything back here. <gasps> oh, yeah. good thing I checked. Yeah, the tarot. All right. All right. The Empress, look at her. Those at the top can fall the hardest. Such a shame to nurture little monsters only to live long enough to watch them kill you. But it's no less than she deserves. I don't know what that was, but I just went for it. JP says, do you think that a werewolf would still attack her or will it leave her alone because it can sense she was bitten? I kind of want to say that uh, she can sense it. Oh, shit. We were going to the same place. <laughs> Never mind. Okay, but it's also... a good thing you went there because. Yep. <gasps> Who's that? Jeez. Is that a kid? Poor kid. 
Head this big. Bobby. Who's Bobby? That's one of the hunters. Oh. It's the older one. Oh, it's a little kid. Oh, it's the older one. Yep. Let's just make sure there's not another clue down this hallway. Oh, hello. <gasps> My God. How many carrot cards do we have? We have a lot of carrot cards. <laughs> All right. The Emperor, authority, paternity, structures designed to topple. No, how the, how the mighty may fall and their empires with them. Let them bleed. Let them rip each other apart. Let them rot. Ooh. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Good job. Thank you. Thank you. Let me see if I have a applause. Okay. Cool. Oh, this is the door that they came through. Got <laughs> Raven says, sounded like Palpatine. Do you think I did? You did a pretty good job. Yes. Christina, I never, uh, the voice acting tonight. I'm trying, girl. Hire me. Well, no, there's a strike, so no. Don't do that. <laughs> That looks like gasoline. Okay. <laughs> Bourbon said F that bet tonight. <laughs> J-Man, you don't have to read the card. She tells you everything it says. But let me have my fun. Yeah. <laughs> it's coming from a bed. Can I go check out that ladder first? No? Okay. I don't think. Oh. Where's Jacob? Okay, everybody quiet. Ooh. Hey, it's Ryan. Jesus, oh, no. what is happened he... to you? Is he just like lost it? Oh no. Well, should we open the cage? Should we, we open the cage? I don't know. I, I don't think so. I don't know. No, because no. it's electrified. Hey, bad idea. Okay, good, good thinking, good call. Good call. Yes, bitch! Yes! Look, you gotta get me out of here, man. How? Seriously. It's electrified. Okay, um, there's a box in the corner of the room. I think that's how they're operated, okay? I saw this old guy, under dude from the woods. He used that. Why are you here, Travis? You ought to be out with the others. Like I say, we've been all night long trying to keep those kids safe. Oh, uh, what? They're good guys? Ma. Uh. <clears throat> it's Kaylee. <gasps> She's dead. <laughs> no. The boys are bringing her in right now. Now I know you got to screw loose in that cop head of yours. There ain't no way to kill her in her kind of condition. Silver bullet. She's dead, Ma. <gasps> oh, no. Is she going to get pissed? No. Okay, before we continue, just, just so I'm, like, rounding up, it makes me feel like they have been trying to keep everyone safe. However, there's still wolves out there yes. trying to kill people, and now somebody got bit, so it's even worse. So their, like, intentions are kind of wrong still. Yeah. Um, so they're getting exposed right now, but now they know that the t the everyone knows, probably, and yeah. they're trying to kill them. So it seems like every month, what they've been doing for the last however many years is that they have kept people away from that area when mm -hmm. it's that time of the month, uh, the sheriff keeps everybody off the roads, mm -hmm. and then the rest of the family goes out and like slathers themselves in blood, yeah. and captures them to bring them back, yeah. and put them in the cell yeah. until they turn back in the morning. And they've been doing this every month. But what has changed? Oh, Laura and Kenny and Max. Because no one's they been using silver bullets. And they just no. What set all of this off was the fact that they decided to come in earlier than expected. Yep. And they have us choosing what the fuck is going on. Mm -hmm. All right, cool. I'm all caught up. Imagine like the very beginning of the game, there's an option for you to just go to the motel and then none of this happens. That would be so funny. Game over. That would be so 30 funny. 30 minutes. No, no, no. 
no, no. Like they're, they're still bad not people. My not my only granddaughter. Not my Kaylee. Not my little Kaylee. Not my little Kaylee. Not my little Kaylee. You goddamn piece of shit. Oh, not my little Kaylee. God damn you. And it's all his fault because he told her about do the silver to bullets and all this other stuff. Yeah. But he wants all to cause... end it. He wants to end this shit. But I think he wants to save his family, not just kill all of them. That's true. And now they're killing people, so now they Did have no choice but to kill them back. Is she crazy? Uh, from we stop doing liar? what? From, doing from what? shooting. Stop liar. Wait. It's him. Think about it. Why would they lock him in a cage? And who the hell is she? Was gonna who shoot, the hell is and she? then we were going to get caught. She's in charge. You've already got it wrong once. It might even be Nick. Your friend? Hey, listen. Okay. They said that they've already got two of us accounted for. Whatever that means. Whoever this is, they're, they're not going anywhere. Okay. Remember, we've got to be sure. You promised. Okay. Right. Right. You gotta get me out of here. Okay, seriously, man. Truman says that was close. Yeah, that was fucking real close. Cody is good at last minute detection. They took it. They took it. You fucking idiot. Ma. God damn it. You fucking piece of shit. <laughs> you tell him. Get away. Get away from me. Oh my God. They're close. <laughs> <laughs> Christina, family donors, am I right? Truly. I feel like we helped Jacob because he has the rotor arm. We need to help Jacob. Okay. 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 Talk me through it. Okay. So. I'm really hoping that it doesn't just turn off all so the you pages. you have to open my door and that door. Wow. And definitely not that door. Oh, okay. Cool. Okay. Thanks, detective. Okay, fuck you, man. I'm trying to help. No, fuck you. I'm trying to. Shut up. Shut up. Okay, there's a console on the wall over there, like a box or whatever. You should be able to use those switches to isolate each cage. Oh, is this a puzzle? Okay. Oh god. Oh Inside. god. Okay. This sounds like this sounds like every game ever, where it's like uh, a little cutscene where it's like, you gotta save me, okay? And the only way to do is to go over to that tunnel, open the, open the latch, and then solve a puzzle and add up all the numbers, and then you also have to divide it by three. But do long division; it'll only be the only choice. And then will you open? the lights <laughs> well what we do know is that the cages are numbered the one that the monster is in is seven the one that jacob's in is three and the one that's in between is five we know that you know that i, know I did that. not know that all right let's Pat do this chosen. all right let's do this all right ah! i just had to let out a scream okay oh, shit. be careful Okay. Oh, fuck. Babe, 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 you said you knew this. You said you knew this. Well, I didn't know that there were only going to be four breakers. Right now, they're all on. Let's do... Well, I'd like how the thing... Really think, what, okay, why is this hard? So I don't know what the breakers are corresponding to because there's three cells. So there are... Well, we just have to turn off one, which is the one with Jacob in. Where's Jacob in? I thought it was three. All right, so if I only throw one, I should be able to unthrow it, right? Okay, do we go to chat and see what the, what the... No, I feel like I gotta do this myself. Something in me is telling me to try breaker three first. Because Mia said, I never got this part. Good luck, though. <laughs> I'm glad it's not, like, timing us. Unless. Unless. 
one, two, three, four is actually corresponding to one, three, five, and seven because we did not see if there's an extra cage on the end, but three, five, and seven would mean potentially that there's a one. I do know, okay, so Jacob did say something in the chat and we trust Jacob. Uh, he said something about simple addition, two at a time. Which means that it would be two and three. So I was going to do three first, so let me do three. Three plus two. Let's try two. Jacob? Don't trust Jacob, you're in the Discord. We, we know. Hey, dude. Nice. All right, now don't fuck it up. Continue. Oh, I can do this. I can do this. Focus, dude. Focus. There's more. If I only do one, it doesn't add up to seven. That's six. It needs to add up to seven? So two and three open cage number five, which means that one and two could open cage number three. I'm doing one because one and two adds up to three. Two. Okay. Yo, my balls are shriveled right now. Oh, it's so damn. fucking stressful. You look awful. No, he I'm looks good oh. still. Where's everyone else? Oh, we have to see the, um, the actor who Jake. plays Jacob after I'm this with them. before we leave because I don't know where she is. that's good material. Well, you should go catch up with them. Mia, oh my Be god, careful. not being this easy. I don't know if there's a way back up. Oh. JP, well, that got my blood pressure going. Girl, Jacob appreciates your help. Thank you so much. Will you fuck us now, please? <laughs> not, my, god, not, not my only granddaughter. Not my Kaylee. She's still saying not my this? Little Kaylee. So you, you had those motherfucking counselors in your goddamn jail Ooh. for two whole motherfucking She's talking months, like me. right? And you are telling me now. Your motherfucking counselors in your motherfucking that jail. Instead, and these motherfucking snakes on this motherfucking each plane. One of their little sorry shit Lynn stained Shane was brains. In that movie too. Wait, you, you, yeah. you gave them your silver bullet gun and they shot my Kaylee with it. Is that what you are telling me now, Travis? No more blood on your hands. That's what you, you, you said it. Oh my God, we are way past that now. Lin Shay is delivering oh, though. Ma, what, what if I'm horrifying. Why was Cody solving that low key hot though? Or, or <laughs> it's the brain. It's the brain. Then? She was your family. A good boy protects his family. You ain't no good boy. <gasps> but you know who is a good boy? The bird, man. Mm -hmm. Look at the good boy just sleeping. I wish I could take it all back, but I can't. Oh, I just don't. I, I don't understand why you, you you couldn't have just taken care of the problem when you had the chance. Taking care of the problem? Do you hear yourself? Yes, I hear my goddamn self. I may be old, but I ain't deaf. I'm a police officer. Oh, so now I'm blind, you motherfucker. Oh, okay. Serve. Oh, you just flashing that badge around like it's worth a million dollars. The only reason you got it is because Hank got killed in a gypsy fire. Ma. Don't ma. Why is this giving um, hereditary, I am your mother? Oh, yes. Monologue. I'm just saying, I just wait. Don't ma me. Would you sit down, please? Don't you tell me what to do. Please. And don't you go around. Don't you go around like you better than everybody else, because you ain't. Would you please sit down? Don't you tell me what to do, you piece of shit. Yes, girl. Oh, what did, what was that noise? Yes. Welcome to my nightmare. Welcome, Zachary Billand. Gotcha. Oh, yeah. what the fuck? Ryan, run! Ma? Oh, abandoned. Send Bobby down. Immediately. Wow, Lynn Shay. Beauty is a tiger. 
Be careful, make sure that shit doesn't bite. Hey, yeah. Her beauty uh. is inside her. Yes. That's why I need to find the key tonight. Key. When I say yes, you say no. At the end of the chapter. <gasps> Here we go. We got Welcome our bitch. Back. Did you miss me? I did. I did. It's been a long time. Hopefully, you've brought me some more of my cards. Let's have a look, shall we? Yeah, let's go. Let's do it. I feel like we have to pick Empress because that's going to be our girl Lynn. The Empress. Look at her. <laughs> yeah, she's, she's Queen B. Though the top can Queen pull B. the hardest. Such a shame to nurture little monsters only to live long enough to watch them kill you. Ooh. But it's no less than she deserves. Ooh. She's got a match. The lovers. There's harmony and disagreement brought to light only by sparks of passion. Blood flows from the heart. You can almost taste it. And tasting it could save someone's life. Oh, shit. What do you mean? Tasting it. The wheel of fortune. After all, fortune is nothing but a spinning wheel. Sometimes you have to take a chance. Karma works in mysterious ways, but it favors those who pay attention. Watch closely. Though the know wheel spins, I know. the eagle-eyed can the tell lovers where one, it's I feel going like it's to stop. Important. The emperor. Authority, paternity, stricter is designed to topple, no? How the mighty may fall, and their empires with them. Let them bleed. Let them rip each other apart. Welcome, Welcome to Dark Monarch. Welcome, Dark Monarch. Ooh. Let's see more, girl. Let's see more. Then choose the possible future you'd like to witness. And watch carefully. Try and find some clarity in the chaos. All right, chat, tell us. Oh, you want to hand it over to the chat? We got four. All right, chat. Cody has called it. Bandwagon army team up what do you think we should choose all right empress lovers a lot of people a lot of lovers, lovers is winning so far a lot of lovers and then write a 10 page essay on why <laughs> oh a lot of lovers looks like lovers is winning isn't that a taylor swift song a lover i don't know sorry i'm not a oh but we got some empresses I think lovers out would. Yep. Okay, but let's take into account what our personal thoughts are. You you originally wanted Empress. Mm -hmm. But for me, when she's talked about lovers, I was like. Like, it feels like there's going to be a clue about saving somebody. Exactly. They were like, in order for you to save someone, you have to taste it yourself. So what does that mean? Maybe we can keep that in handy. But the Empress could give us like a... Um, a look Welcome into like how we can nightmare. kill her or the emperor was kind of like there's gonna be something about them infighting yeah right like they they go at each other's necks and wheel of fortune looks like there's going to be where i mean with this kind of because someone said look at the card there's a white wolf that the arrow is being pointed to. So it makes me think we're going to have to choose between three people to shoot. And this might give us a hint as to who that is. Oh, shit. Oh, because they're all the same looking werewolf. But one, one is white. Of, one is white. Fuck. Fuck. Okay. Someone said lovers isn't that helpful. 
Emperor sounds like she created the line for what she mediocre at best. Being re oh, sorry, it's, it's all I did. that's another <laughs> comment. Mia, maybe Empress or Wheel of Fortune might be the move. The misleading from chat is crazy. Oh God, uh, created the monsters only to have them kill her. What do we think? I'm leaning more towards Wheel of Fortune now. Really? Mm -hmm. That was unexpected. Um, we have to take into art like, oh, this is like RuPaul's Drag Race rules. Ultimately, the choice is ours to make. What will it be? Well, what are you thinking? Um, <clears throat> Laura is like, you do you. Okay, <clears throat> sorry guys. Um, You know how we're bad at deciding, so I think maybe the Wheel of Fortune is something we should watch. All right, Wheel of Fortune it is. Go. Welcome to Wheel of Fortune. You still got time. Be careful now. Be oh, thank you, Mama. Careful. Oh, thank you so much, Mama. Serve. Slay. Okay. Ooh. <laughs> Camille said. Uh, she said, "Fuck our drag." Let's be clear. No, we. I was leaning towards Empress until we talked it through as a chat a little bit. We just wanted to see what you guys. We we wanted to take the chat's choice in consideration. That's what we wanted to do. But ultimately, the choice is ours to make. <laughs> okay, wait, guys. Let's watch this. Let's see what what it does. Okay. I don't even know if that gave me any information. Oh, this is this is the opposite of what we thought it was. There's three people. We're gonna, basically going to have to figure out who the is same? the one that doesn't get murdered by this thing. So if we watch again. I saw we Emma. Police Emma. We got Bubba. And that is Dylan. Ryan. No, that's Ryan. That's yeah, Ryan you're right. getting stabbed in the face. So our choice is either who is the first one? Watch it one more time. Who is that first person? Emma. It's Emma or no, is it Emma. Laura? Um, Laura. Laura changes. And then there's going to be one of three people who we have so to So Laura changes. And that is coming up in the next chapter. Mm -hmm. So either he dies or we die. Yes. Oh, shit. Uh, Jacob Young. I had a feeling Empress was something about Lin Che. I thought so, too. Uh, Joseph, I love this game. So happy you guys are doing running through it. Yes, thank you so much. We are loving it. It's more to have agency over your audience. Don't apologize. Oh, thank you, Taj and Chick. James the Cat, I keep hearing that Roblox. Oof, so no. <laughs> Please keep playing. We're going to stop here. Yeah, we, we, we are going to finish it up next week. Next week, come back. And we're going to do the grand finale of The Quarry. But first, I gotta show you, I gotta show you this man. Hold on. Okay. All right. So we don't need to save, right? We'll replay this next week. Yeah, we'll, we'll probably watch it like a, definitely right. a few more times. Oh no, you have to go to the menu. All right. Um, what's the guy's name? I don't know. The Corey Jacob actor. Zach Tinker. Oh, this is Okay, I'm gonna I'm not gonna put it on because I, I'm afraid like if what if like porn comes up. <laughs> <laughs> uh Zach Tinker. Well thank you for the super chat, Cubby Holes. Thank you so much. Zach Tinker. Zach, tink Zach can tinker with me. Oh my God. Hold up. All right. I just need y'all. I just need y'all to come, come, come on this journey with me. Us. 
chat. Oh no, why can't I do this? No. They need to know. It's a scream, baby. <gasps> oh my god. Why can't I show you? I need to show you. Window capture. Huh. I wonder why he's not doing it. Let me add it here. <laughs> I'm so determined <laughs> to show you guys. I think it's a window capture. Let's do that again. Window capture. Ooh. Ooh. <gasps> oh, there it is. There it goes. All right, chat. Do you see that? You all see that? I just I just want to put it I just want to put it out there. That is Jacob. That is Jacob himself. Mm -hmm. Go follow his Twitter, Zach Tinker. <laughs> Everyone's like, "Oh shit." That <sighs> Okay. I thought we should end on a really really good note. So, we're going to we're not even going to go back to the intermission screen. We're going <laughs> to leave it on here. Guys, let me actually, oh, whatever. I, I won't put music on. Guys, thank you so much for joining us today. It was a bumpy ride, but we got through it. Mm -hmm. We got it a little bit more confident. We did get to see a kill. So we got to see, like, who, how somebody would have died. Yep. And boy, they don't skimp out on the gore. Mm -mm. They are not skimping out on the um, how brutal these deaths are gonna be. And it's so horrible because you get so close to all these characters. Yeah. Um, so thank you. Remember, we are, we're gonna try our best to not use the saves. Moving forward, we're not using the saves. So if someone does die, they have to die. Yep. We'll mourn them, we'll play a song, and then we're gonna move forward. Or, not or, we're just gonna have to accept it as it is. But we're yeah. gonna try our best to, to save them all. Um, Remember, guys, we have our Saw 4 reaction out today. Mm -hmm. Yesterday, we released Scream Queens. Next week uh, will probably be another movie before we move on to another Saw movie. Um, more Scream Queens. And, of course, the finale of The Quarry when we live stream it. Anything else that we're missing? I don't think so. Just, you know, make sure you join the, the <laughs> Discord. <laughs> wait, this isn't working. Christian, wait, what did you say? I was staring at the <laughs> pictures. <laughs> Cubby holes. If they die, they die. He said. <laughs> Honestly, y'all, this was so much fun. It was so much fun. Thank you so much. I mean, listen, we're at four hours and twenty-seven uh, seconds minutes. so far. Twenty-seven minutes. We're doing good. And y'all are still with us. And thank you so much, Jamesy Cat. I love you guys so much. I'm so happy to have been here for two years. If you ever need someone to name your albums, call me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so happy for all of you, and I'm quite happy to hear sending you guys. Oh my God, you guys oh, are you. awesome. Thank you so much. Crazy Mac T, love your comments. And we'll see you in the Discord. Make sure that you'd like, subscribe, and ring that bell for notifications. Absolutely. All right. Until next time, we have been your source for horror analysis. Criticism. And spooky, okay? And sometimes kooky. Entertainment. Good night, everyone. Good night.